Bruh. We got we got a cool game called the um, uh, Mega Man. It's too long. Uh, the, the name's too long. I'm not doing it. Let's see, let's see. What were we doing exactly? What were we doing? Ah! Right, 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 right. I need to get a map of this place. So the goal is to make it to the fourth floor. Get to that thing called Big Metal Dogu. Kill it. You have to kill it with skills too, apparently. Not the uh, like regular attacks, and it has a very high chance of running away, like eighty-five percent or something. You have to you have to kill it immediately. I don't know why, but you feel like you heard someone say these were shovelware RPGs. Shovelware is supposed to be quick to complete, right? Well, it's been like 50, 60 hours. Why am I still in this game? Shovelware is like you press a button and you get a bunch of trophies. That's, that's what shovelware is. This place looks pretty wild. Maybe they meant shovelware in terms of quality. In which case, uh, we can agree to disagree. I like this series. It's pretty cool. Or a coat. Hmm. Ooh, ooh, we're on a map list here. Holy fuck! This map is actually really complicated. Where there was how in the uh, I was never making it to the f fourth floor, man. What the fuck. In area five as well. Actually, five floors. Ah. Crazy. There's hidden rooms here too. What the fuck? I feel like this map could have been done better in a way that's more visually appealing and easier to understand. It had the legend in the corner instead of having the legend on the main page. We have to go back and be like, uh, how do I read this thing? Definitely could have done the map better. What's that one company that makes nothing but shovelware achievement games? Uh, actually, gotta say, I don't really care about shovelware, so I don't know the names of the companies. I don't buy shovelware games. I don't really see the point of playing a game and like unlocking all the trophies in like 10 minutes. This place because you pet it, pet the cat 500 times or whatever. Like a bajillion strokes of whatever animal. Oh, is East Asia soft? Oh, okay, okay. Those people know who they're marketing to. They're marketing to the people who want the trophies. They just like want the number. I want to work for my trophy, though. I don't mind short games as long as, you know, it's not a shovelware game. Like, if it's like a two-hour cute little adventure game where you get a cool story. Like, uh, what's that one called I did a while back that was about two hours? About an hour and a half, actually. It was like Memoir Blue or something. That one was a pretty cool story. I don't necessarily mind short games, but it's got to be like, it's got to be interesting. It's got to have a story. It's got to have something to it. Not just do whatever super easy. Well, I'll dip targets if you don't have anything. Ah, true, 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 true. I think I've got all my targets this month. And I didn't even do anything. I don't go for the targets deliberately. I just sign up for the targets and if I get them, I get them. I think I got all mine this month. I have no idea why either. I played some games and uh, they got me the things. Let me double check. I got gold on one of them, but not the other one. I think it was true achievements that I got all the gold on. And I got nothing on the... Oh, no. It's the other way around. 
Okay. So it's not. I got nothing for true achievements. I must have gold on the true trophies then. I slide up for them on both sides and then just play my games normally. And if I get them, I get them. But I don't. I don't. Yeah, I've got golds on the trophy side. <laughs> Looks like they just checked. Let's see. This is possibly the worst map I've ever seen in my life. The legend is literally on a different page. I'm looking at like the fandom wiki page for this map, map of this dungeon. Might just be one of the worst maps I've ever seen. Better than nothing, but... It's just got random different colored lines, then numbers and letters, and I have to go to the other page to see what the letters mean. So let's see... Uh, what, is, what are the numbers mean? Oh, the numbers are treasures. Okay. Alright. You actually need that jumping star thing to progress in this dungeon. Looks like. Hey, right, where's the way to like floor two? The, nu the numbers are... Maybe it's the letter A? Eh? Uh, yeah, this is uh, a very understandable uh, map. But yeah, there's no map here, so uh, I'm not I'm not doing that shit. May maybe somebody wants to wander around. This is extremely complex. I can see now by looking at the map on the internet. This is a very complex, elaborately designed dungeon. Maybe somebody wants to run around like a chicken with their head cut off, but that ain't me. It's a very complex dungeon, especially floors two and three. Especially three in particular. Three is insane. Who the hell is ever getting past floor three? Without well, using a map. We're gonna carefully go around and try to get all these treasures. <laughs> Why is that number yellow and the other ones are orange? I should write today's diary entry in my nip note. One hidden room in areas one to four each. What does that mean? Phew, I'm tired. One to four each. Does that mean there's a hidden room in each floor, or there's a hidden room that takes you from one to four, or what? I either can't read or I'm having a good time here. You gotta plug it for 360 so you can buy some of these discounted non backwards compatible games. You can't do it on like the uh, web pa store page. There's like two different uh, online stores, right? So if I go basically straight past this. All of these dudes here will kill me, by the way. They're like. They're like, what am I? They're like 40 levels above me. All these guys are like level 95. So the goal is to get to floor four without getting into a fight with anybody. Ooh, an item. And if I do, just try to run away and see if I can live. So the EX number is in the amount of enemies, right? E2, E2, must be two enemies. Oh, so we're gonna go this way. And up here's gonna be two enemies to dodge. We basically have to go that way. And there should be a treasure here. Yeah. We could do that, but this would actually make me hook up consoles. See how it hooked up. Ah, oh, sure, sure, sure. I have to look to see which ones are like 
digital only, and uh, you can't get them on like uh, disc at all. And then uh, I still might do 360 over PS3 because you know the PS3 ones are never going to be on sale ever again. Even if Sony shuts down the store at some point, you know they're never going to put those on sale. They're really too bad. I was thinking about getting that uh, Batman Blackgate ones. It's apparently it's like the first time it's ever been on sale ever. You know it's never going to be on sale on PS3, so I'm, t I'm tempted by that one. I haven't seen uh, what the other ones are, though. Oh, wait. Okay, I'm right there. There's actually a warp point over here, which is interesting. Oh, it's an exit. Exit's here. Okay. That's a one-way passage. What do yellow lines mean? Let me see. Yellow lines indicate a fake wall. Jump across to find a hidden room. Oh, okay. Sounds pretty intriguing. I should write today's diary entry in my nip note. There's a fake wall like right here. Oh. oh. There is. Intriguing. There's nothing here though. There's just an enemy. There's no treasure. Enemy in there. I can see why, why they marked him with yellow lines now. Like oh, it's a one-way trip. I gotta take the warp point then. Uh. Run. Where am I? Two treasures this way. And no enemies. Probably means like the next area. This will lead me towards. It's a different one. It's a yellow one instead of an orange one. What, is, what does yellow one mean? I go back to the page, look at the legend. Oh, it's a hidden treasure tile. So that's where the top, that's where the hidden treasure will appear. Phew. I'm tired. I think I'll take a break around here. No, you won't. You won't take a break around here. Hello. Bye, guys. There should be three treasures here. Got an item. And that'll be all the treasures on this floor. Here you go. Most of the treasures worthless. Ooh. I just wanted to get it because I wanted to get it. I have no idea what any of it is. I didn't look it up. There's a list, but I didn't look at it. <laughs> okay, let's go to floor two now. Run! I made it to the floor two last stream, but then I was like, okay, I'm completely lost and uh, I have no clue what I'm doing and I'm out of here. Orange A means the next area. Woohoo! 
Okay, I put a floor two, put a map. Floor two map. Floor two map. Uh, a crap ton of treasure all over the place. Ooh, found a rare insect. I better put it in my specimen book. I wonder what, I I did find that. Neptune's weapon on this floor. I don't know which one of these numbers it is. Though. Treasure at the end of this. I didn't find it anyway. Nope, I didn't find it. Ooh, an item. Crawler. We have a little crawler on our head. Oh, flying next to her. Does it fit me well? I guess it does. Got a little crawler fly next to her now. Like her weakened form though. That's cool. Hmm. This is really intriguing. There's three enemies in here. A bunch of platforms to jump up to nine? How am I getting to that? Oh, oh thank you, sir. Oh, I've gotten this treasure. I've gotten this one. I think I remember getting this one now, actually. Run straight. There's literally no reason to go right. There's zero treasures right. All the rest of the treasures are to the left on this pit floor. Why would I go right? Because I don't know where I'm going, obviously. Now, this is probably where I found Neptune's weapon. This is about where I stopped then, because I was like, uh, I'm going to need map. I definitely needed a map though. I would never have found the uh, fake walls. Just not not a chance. All right, so I should be there. So that's a dead end with no items right over here apparently. Double check. Yep. So there's a fake wall. Right here. Ooh. Here you go. And the only thing you get for finding this fake wall is two very common healing items. And you'd think they would at least stick something rare behind a fake wall. Like, lol, no. And your reward for finding this is fuck all. Ooh, maybe this was the hidden treasure. The Neptune's weapon, because it's not here. Maybe this is as far as I got. A long hallway. Hmm. 
Here's where the enemies should be. Apparently there's treasure in the corner of this room. Oh, I don't see it. Did I get it then? Probably did. Hmm. So that should be all the treasures on this floor then. We just have to get to the next floor now. Looks like it's gonna be the fun, fun part. There's a boss here, apparently. Woo! <laughs> big boss to dodge. It's a big room. Wait, let's see. I go that. That doesn't look like it's gonna be easy to dodge. Ugh. Hmm. The thing Mark B wasn't there. Maybe he's only there if you have a if you found a strong enemy. Run! Made it to floor three. All right, next map. Four three looks insane, man. It's a lot of winding pathways full of not not too many enemies, though. Ooh, found a rare insect. I better put it in my specimen book. A whole bunch of nonsense on this floor. There's the treasure. Ooh, an item. There's no point in going this way. All I got is two enemies, no treasure. Oh, look at that fucker. <laughs> uh, terrifying. There's a whole bunch of fuck all this way. This door, enemies, no treasure. This door leads to fake wall, which has treasure. Fighting stuff. Intrigue. Oh, wait. This one's the one that leads to the enemy. Next one. I was like, wait, but it still doesn't match what I saw the map. Break wall right here. <laughs> Meta fiction. I have no idea if that's good or not, but that's at least better than getting some healing items. Highlight your message. Dolby. Hi, Dolby. Get the heck out of here, Mr. You're trying to find some spoilers. You believe this nonsense? Get the heck out of here right now. Hello, hello. Thanks for stopping by. Purple stare to you too. No, you can't see. Good. Just wanted one last look at the place. At the place? Uh, last look? Are you going somewhere? I'm trying to get rid of me again. Man. You're the one who doesn't want spoilers. What's over here? Oh. Scary things. Ooh. <laughs> Yeah, I'm totally trying to get rid of you, though. How'd you know? All I can see is the narrow strip of my avatar. Phew! 
Thank goodness. I'm here and I'm a Sithy exciting. Got an item. Until you are. Man, tell somebody to get some proper rest and they say yeah, you're getting rid of them, I swear. Man, my name just. I'll take a break around here. What character am I? You mean like playing? Controlling? I can't tell you that. And say rest to get out of here cause spoilers. Watch out, buddy. We're doing some serious stuff. Ooh, an item. Oh, it's all doing some serious things. Right, right, right. It's not a last look anyway. I'm not evicting you. I'm definitely not finishing this game today. We're getting there though. Mm. Ooh. Run. Jump. Ooh, an item. I bet it's stern heart. I don't know who that is, but yes, that's right. How did you know? What the fuck is that? You know, I just made her up. Good, 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 good. Seems like she'd be a good character. Dot, dot, dot. What are you dot, dot, dot? What you said? Ah. Some very serious stuff will have enough. Ooh, found a rare insect. I better put it in my specimen. I should I should probably open up the trophy guy though. Mm-hmm. Hmm, hmm. Maybe I'll read a bit. Ooh. 
I mean, gosh, I'd call her Snow Heart. Isn't that basically just blonde, though? White Heart, Snow Heart, pretty much the same thing. She's even got a snowy area called Louie. No, man. I'm gonna leave you. Oh, picky. It's not very interesting watching a narrow slit of your avatar. Blonde is white, snow is snow. What color is snow though? You're gonna be like, it's whatever color it lands on. It's color dirt. You're like, what? Uh, I'm working on very exciting stuff, but it's, pro it's probably a big spoiler for you, so. You should have run while you have the chance. What the fuck is that? Whoop! Ah, okay. You can see anything. That's good. You can't see me sweating. Uh. Wait, where am I? You can see me what? Sweating? Let's grow up for that. No! Don't you dare! Don't you dare! may ban you now. You know I'm not gonna do that. Good, 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 good. found my target. 
Prepared for what we're doing here? Hmm, probably not. Change it up. have to try it and see how it works out. It'll go goodbye forever. See you later, Dolby. Go go save yourself from the spoilers. Be free. Here you go. We got the first strike. Let's Leave crush him. Nothing to do. That really missed. about this one. You're so naive. Next, I'm just glad Got him. I what I started. There's nothing to do that to me hey, I sit around getting spoilers. Oh my gosh. I believe this. I believe this. Hmm. Yeah, I like the I like this bonus. I can do that either. Hmm. Well, I recommend the. Uh, hmm. Go um um uh, uh, pet your cats. That's what you do. Gotten stronger. Hmm. Well, get some vitamin D like you suggested the other night. Yeah, vitamin D is good for you. We all love some vitamin D. Whatever that means is that thing you get when you're out in the sun.
from now. Oh, okay. That's right. You get that sunshine, okay? I know it's totally the time of day where you'd have sun outside. I'm not interested in levels. Holy. Whoop! Run away. The name's Uzume Tanoboshi. Yeah. Probably slightly better, though. Oh, we wait. Break around here. Now we're uh, waiting to fight again. <laughs> Ooh, found a rare insect. I better if I, if I should finish the... this game, then I should play. Let's still be list of banned games. We, we should just do go through the list. Tuesday forever blockaded. <laughs> Yippee! You're all going serious. in my specimen book. You could bounce up playing band games. Or I mean you could just uh, you have a choice to not watch, you know. One shot now. Crazy. Yeah, level up. Level up. Ooh, I've gotten stronger. I'm getting even stronger. Level up. Will this level? Oh, how about maybe I'm getting aura. Level up. Cha la 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 cha. Run. <coughs> There, you, you know where the X button is. Ah, uh, you, you know where the, the pirate man with a uh, blindfold runs is. Why should I have to ban to dictate what you choose to I'm click on? Come on now. You're an adult. Here. No, I'm not trying to get rid of you by saying that. You're gonna, you're gonna interpret it that way though. Like, is freedom of choice oppression? <gasps> Don't know where the X is. It's like the top right corner, at least for me. I should write today's diary entry in my. It's also like a little, uh, top top left corner back butt ton. <laughs> A rare insect. I better put it in my specimen book. Try and guide me. I'm trigger. Oh my gosh. I'm just saying, you're not required to watch. <laughs> Might stand a chance for this one, though. <laughs> We're about to get a cool trophy. Better watch out. I did it! I leveled up. Oh, not this round. I think I'm a little close Next round. To now. Oh, Maybe. I'm glad I'm still developing nicely. Level up. Level up. Will this let my view? Level up. Actually, probably not next round. Probably the round after that. <gasps> yeah, you understand, do you know? Are you sure about that? Phew. I'm tired. What does that mean? Mm hmm. 
Thanks for stopping by. Today's diary entry in my nip note. Do 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 Hmm, I like his positioning. Phew. I'm tired. I Get back over here. One away. Ooh, I've gotten stronger. I'm getting even stronger. All right, let's go make the next one. Will this let my beauty to me? Level up. Next one. <laughs> Today's diary entry in my nip note. Take a break around here. Yay! Successful surprise attack! GG. Level attained. Trophy arc. <gasps> Level nine nine. <laughs> I think I'm a little closer to Neptune now. Level up. Level up. Check me over that because I have the level, level DLC. Since like it was free. Maybe I'm, I, 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 not I'm not interested in levels. Hmm, question is. Everything will be fine if you leave it to me. I do want to put the things on the what wait, where are they? Uh... Oh wait, you're not in the main party, that's right. Care for you guys. Actually, I should leave it on those guys, shouldn't I? They should take them off the ones we don't care about. <laughs> Who don't we care about them? You guys, get out here. Leaves three, right? This is great. How 
I don't think I'll put him into 99, but, uh... I want to give them one round so they get a good boost. I don't remember if I used them for in the story though. I certainly don't use them right now. Like em? Maybe I'll read a bit. I don't care about them characters. Oh wait. Oh yeah. Okay, ship there. Hey Ivor, what's up? What's happening? Let's go. I don't tonight. You should watch my stream, but you're too tired. That's fine. You gotta take care of yourself first, Trap. Yeah, get your sleep. Oh, Thanks for stopping by, though. Like today's diary entry in my nip note. get the rest of the treasures on this floor though just for the heck of it. One, two, three, four left. Phew. I'm tired. I think I'll take a break around here. Oh, that's right. I should write. We got the first strike. It's my turn. This battle will end here. I'm sorry. Yay, we won. Level up. Level up. Only two levels at this point. Yikes. Well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys don't need the rest of this garbage. Just enough, just in case I need you for something. What I don't know. Imagine actually needing them for anything. Not bad. How is it? Let's look at the map here. This way. Is this way? Oh yeah, it is this way. Right, right here. Oh, I have to go uh, quite a ways to get an, uh, another treasure if I want, though. This is the way out of here, but... Still don't know if I want to fight those guys. Even though I'm now higher level than them, though. I'm not brave. Whoa. Jump. Bop. Wow, went all the way away for that. Wow, amazing. Ugh. Basically, I'm directly across. 
Run! <laughs> Here you go. Hey, back her. Let's well get you while I'm st here. Levels a piece now. Level oh, you did three. I'll be a little early in there. This way, isn't it? Hmm. Uh-oh, we got lost. What? I'm right there, then. Okay, I'm found again. Treasures here. Whoa. I'd be able to fight these guys now, but. Ooh, an item. I'd still rather not. Save all our progress. Not all us here, just this dude. Yep, that's all us here, just this. Well, we should try to fight him, uh, especially since we just got to save. He might, he might kick my barrier though. I have no idea what level he is. Here you go. Show me just how strong you really are. Let's see, let's see. Holy shit. Look at, look at his HP bar. Oh, yeah, I don't have high hopes right here. Whoa. Uh. Yikes. He does some damage. Hey Gabe, what's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? It has been a while. Hope you've been doing well. I shall go for What should I do? He's 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 uh, pretty strong. Here's a spirit. All right, into the spirit. He's pretty strong. Did he almost one shot her? The fuck. Know yeah. that. I don't think you're supposed to fight this guy. You're like way higher level. Can 
We did pretty good damage. Rob with 75 HP. We can take all four of them in a fight. All four of who? The ladies? No. The dragon guy? Still no. We can take four mosquitoes in a fight, maybe. What's up? What's happening? How's it going, Pyro? How you doing tonight? And I'm doing pretty well, Gabe. We just got our level 99 trophy. I'm fighting this guy for fun. Cause I'm insane. Hmm, she probably just dead. Ooh, 200 HP. This guy's gonna take ages to beat if I can. Well, I did work very well. Neptune does nothing to him. I'm sure we could win then 2v4. Still not. I think you underestimate these ladies. You got to have two turns. You gotta have like two turns, right? Pretty much back to back. Should I 
Yeah, I missed. Nobody does much of anything except for skills. about right think of a plan I can board them out with meaningless questions you nail scratch my guess totally work hmm you need this more than I do. what should I do ah she's still paralyzed Got her root. I can't take him seriously with that voice, sorry. It's not happening. It's another turn in the saga. Yeah, that's what I expected. infinite amount of small numbers in between big numbers like one and two hmm I wait one ever turn into if we need another infinite small number turn one one point one into one point two is that, is that what that comma is a decimal point I know some places use de commas instead of decimal points for some reason crazy people I, 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 I see right there crazy people Paralyzed again. Alright. Into the specimen. How can you say thanks for that when you're paralyzed? Wait. not work if uh and she's paralyzed ah okay i don't know if i have anything to cure that probably maybe i got a few 
witness all. Here, heal up. All right, into the specimen book. What should I do? Here we go. I'll follow. Mm, it's paralyzed again. Can you smack him with Chloe? Ooh, they couldn't possibly fight a cat, so therefore I'd win. Therefore I'd win. I can't fight a kitty cat. Basically, just getting bullied. Defeat this boss, need to kill 11 times. How many bars that is? How many bars are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. He has 21 HP bars, right? Oh, see, each one of those notches is a uh, full bar, plus the bar at the beginning, right? We got him about halfway down. If he doesn't unleash some super OP bullshit when he's almost dead, then this will be fine. But he probably will. Hmm, you're dead. She's just straight up dead. Bullying her, I swear. Neptunia does zero damage, that's correct. Neptunia's job is to build the EXE drive gauge bar. Paralyzed. Is he a he's a god of whoa? That's what the name of his little uh, thing is. So I guess so. He wouldn't lie about his title, would he? That'd be crazy.
I definitely wouldn't lie about that. All right, one of them's paralyzed. Can't do anything if one of them's paralyzed. And I didn't buy a bunch of anti-paralysis stuff, so. Oh, you're not paralyzed no more. I shall go forth. Now, who to choose? Should uh, let her die, I guess. Actually, you got the dragon gauge. That's your job. She lived. She lived through that. She lived through that. That kitty could defeat all five of them. Oh man. He could definitely at least intimidate them. So scary. Gets another round right after this. Where is she? Definitely doesn't like Uzuma. New move. Did less fucking damage than his regular attacks do. Okay. Right. Okay. Turn. 
All right, I got one more go round before. Eh, she didn't really do anything though. It seriously doesn't do like any more fucking damage than your basic bitch tax. <clears throat> Kinda like a kid? Woo! Well, maybe. Well, the Oxus here is go off zero, be sure it only gets crazier. Oh my gosh. Oh, yeah, you're right there. Oh. So it can multi-hit. Gotta watch out for that, then. GG. I took like 20 minutes. I took like 20 or 30 minutes. Well. Hey, Kat. What's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? Hyper Pro Cat Ears, Multiverse, Multicolors, Multiform, Super Grinder, Trophy Collector, Multidimensions, and more to the title. Streamer. Yeah, streamer's a lot shorter. Streamer's a lot shorter, you know. Now that encapsulates everything you just said. We're past half this year. Can't wait for December. Oh yeah! I did it! I leveled up. Level up. I got an eject button for that. And some past memory thing. Oh well, worth it. Come on now. Well, I guess we're done with this dungeon. I was fighting that guy for fun. Just to see what he'd do. We got all the treasure except the hidden treasures. But there's no point in getting the hidden treasures. Because a trophy for the hidden treasures can only be done on the true ending playthrough. Not normal ending like I'm on now. Because you have to get all the dungeons done in one playthrough. And there's just some dungeons that only show up on the true ending playthrough. So I guess we'll get out of here. Oof, we're gone. Mm, is it crazy? Defeat all deployed enemies. Oh my gosh. What do I do with my life now? Miss, but did you get that card for the achievement? I did. I got it last track. 
Super rare something. Super rare indeed. I got a last three. I wonder where the party's at. Oh yeah, I was gonna do the hundred hit hundred hits and hundred k. Oh yeah, I wanted to do Coliseums as well. Do all the Coliseum fights for fun. They're coming from above. What, what should I do? The heck are you? Him get over here. Get fit. That didn't hurt. You guys are too low level now. You were kind of scary on the way over here, though. Now you're nothing. Did everyone see how I did? Isn't that prophilia 100%? Oh. Oh, yeah. I knew I was going to get an enemy here, too. I did last time too. These guys must show up 100% of the time. Got your parts. Broke your hands. He's good, I don't know. I'm a quest to cheese. Yeah, I bet you did find new enemies. Ah. I might need that item for something though. I doing now? Oh yeah, I was gonna go try out Coliseum fights. Do all the sub 100 ones for fun. One of those ones is the one recommended for the 100 hits though. Not sure which one. I'm done on the achievement list. Nah, I still got ways to go to get all the trophies. So far tonight, I've d done the level 99 trophy. I went through Senmu Labyrinth and uh, uh, killed things and uh, uh, got level 99 for pretty much everybody. Now I'm gonna go look at the 100 hits and 100,000 damage. I choose you. Let's, uh, let's, uh, let's beat up some Coliseum people first. Uh. Let's do it. Let's do our best. Leave it to me. Gold. You can't run away, kind of. Ooh, he bit pretty beefy. Her recommended level of 40. My guys are over 100 now. You guys are actually pretty beefy. Did you do something, man? I'll end this all. Don't mess with me. What are you doing? Finally. Sorry to slash and dash. We won. We won. W I N. 
Move on, move on, move on. Hmm. This might be the one that I saw. Let's see. Oh, no, it's Large Dog Goose Assemble. It's the recommended one for 100k. Oh, I see that one at C rank. You're a duck parent pro, you are, huh? What's up, what's happening? How's it going, Max Kimball? How you doing tonight? I'll take care of a duck. I don't know the first thing about taking care of a duck. What do they even eat? Duck stuff, I guess. Missed. Uh. I'm a force of fury. You're in the way. Let's nip things up. I'll nip you all. Picture and film Discord earlier. Yeah, I saw it. A very cute little duck. Ducks probably wonder what. When did mom get so big? Whoa! What's going on? I'm getting fired up. My turn. I've been waiting. Alright, into the specimen book. Fuck you, Game Cubic. Not Game Cube, Game Cubic. Not that virtual boy thing that just fucking died. Nobody knows. Who's next? Couldn't feel a thing. I'll be serious. I'm a force of fury. You're in the way. Dream Custard? The Dream Cast? Dream Custard? It's the same sound effect they use for SR cards. You'd be like, <gasps> what card did they get? Regular status. Oh, people from the story, huh? I'll fly us into a future do we fight Warichu in the story in this game? I already forgot. I think we do one time. Holy fuck. She toast, man. Warichu drops a compa trading card. Okay. That is about right. That's about right. <laughs> what are you doing with that, young man? Your duck's name is Batman because he was an orphan and took him under your wing. Oh! Yeah, that's a race of the bay, a crime fighter.
You get CPU chips for that one, huh? I don't need those no more. I'll be your personal opponent. Uh, you guys again. She done. I shall go What should I do? I'll end this all. Don't move me. To the I shall go My muscles. Are screaming. Oh, you see the undies now for the quiz? That's right. Not relevant though, more though. Hey, Woo Up, what's up? What's happening? How's it going? How you doing tonight? What's cracking, lacking? What's crackle lacking? Only we know what they did to the this wall. The sacred is to try a bunch of everybody up and use the AOE skills, huh? I feel like I lack up, I feel like it never lacks anything. That's goddamn right. Goddamn right. Let's try it with this group. But if that doesn't work, we will have to. Oh, we didn't get the set up with everybody bunched together. I've been waiting. I'm a force of fury. All right, into the specimen book. Did you do something? Invincibility <laughs> time. Useless. Useless. Hey. Huh? I'll be serious. What should I do? I'm a force of fury. I shall go for <laughs> Just kidding. Yeah. It's my turn. I even have AOE skills. I do. so well when you're already stuck behind them.
Oh yeah. Bad, you're so big. I can't get to everybody. Probably use the recommended. Well, or people. I shall go for. <laughs> Just kidding. Badge too far, too close. Too close. It's Boom. Did you do something? Hmm. They're all too spread apart. Omeo, light em up. Probably have to use the recommended characters. But the strategy is also to start with the layout where the small guys are behind the big guy. You can bunch them up. I like the pudding strat. That was a cool strat, wasn't it? I think that these people could probably work, but I need the correct setup. We'll see. You have to forfeit the fight until you get the formation when the big dog goes in front to ensure the small dog dog will gather up behind. I think these people could work, but I just need the right formation. You're saying I lack the ability to stay on the road in F1. Excuse me? I can't believe you would say this. My driving is amazing and I'm really good at staying on the road. I'll have you know. No way, either of those people are gonna get, get over there. It's across the field.
You're in the way. Ah. To the chest. You were such a pain. I finished this stylishly. Good at getting stronger. Oh, how I love that level up sound. Let you guys do. This one might work, but we need the setup where the oh the big guys in front, right? Yeah. Let's set uh, up where big guy in front. Everyone defend up in the center, huh? My turn. Finally. It's my turn. Hmm, doesn't look very good here. What should I do? I'm a force of the big guy moved. Let's nip things up. Mm, that might work. Her skill not the best one for this though. Trying right, to see if I get four. A max is three. Like we'll do the actual setup that's recommended. Omeo, light him up. So, how terrible. I wish didn't do it right. right. Into the now I can only get four. Uh, that's not the right one. Got 50k that time. Has to be 100k damage in like one combo. Hmm. Let's say a recommended party is Ram, Rom, Big Neptune, and I. Oh. I guess we still like pudding. Hmm. Another method apparently is uh, fighting a big group of weak enemies. Yeah, that's true. I could have transformed to get more damage, could I? He 
Detailed details. Details, details. I did stream yesterday, did you? I did not. I did not! That was tragic. Look at these guys' AoE skills. Game industry's lone gust of wind will blow. Wrong setup. Oh, I moved over to the r that side. Don't look down on me I'm small. I want everybody kind of bunched up to get in the wall. Let's nip things up. <laughs> Leave things to me. Hmm, that might be good. The range of this thing. That's only three, isn't it? Until it's rifle fall. Stand back. There's no need to break your life senselessly. My turn. Shiga. Much everybody but that other guy. Yeah. It's got a really wide circle. Let's see if I can get the last guy though. Seems not. I killed. No! I shall go for. I'll take her on quiet, Gaddix. We're missing the last guy in the group. I can't tell if I'm getting the pink one or not. Ninety K. If I had gotten the last guy, it would totally work. Now I know I need the whole group. I can't get the whole group, but not gonna work. I won't lose to the likes of my turn. Ah, it's gotta be a big guy in front. Apart. My turn. It's my turn. Finally. <laughs> now then, who wants to die? Ooh, maybe there. He defended the. How dare you? I'll sit. Oh, 
Dang it. I don't think I get both. Get a... Almost. Who should I target? I'm a CPU too. All right, into the specimen book. My turn. Wait, am I getting Mauler? I think I did. I'm not getting him though, am I? Oh, you piece of shit. But not getting him though. One, two, three, four, four. How many are there? One, two, three, four, five. I need to get all six. I think big guy's too far away. You can get all the small guys, but big guy too far away. Rip. Oh, I bet you're too far back now. I bet you're too far back now. Hey, you piece of shit. Who should I target? I'm a CPU finally. Oh. My turn. Look at this bullshit. I'm just trying to get them all bunched up together. It's my turn. Let's nip things up. Now then, who wants to die? I bet you guys are too far back now. Yeah. Almost at it. Now let's go. Could you like not move? Could you like stay? Giant doggo, could you just stay still so everybody bunched up behind you? And be like, no. And be like, no. Oh, wait. Can't tell. Too many boxes to read. Oh, wait, you got those little things, don't you? One, two, three. Okay, see all that little... Flashing yellow in the top left. We got all six targeted now. Something hidden in that battle. Yeah, 100k damage trophy. Stand back. There's no need to raise your life senselessly. Who should I target? Which one's the one? Ice Hammer, E Force Blizzard. Ice Hammer does more. Can I hit all of them? All the... Uh, uh, whichever one I can hit all of them. There we go. This is super amazing magic I got from Blonde! All of them. Go! Oh yeah, we did it. Maximum firepower. Trophy earned! Woo! Didn't even need pudding. We gotta do pudding for a good measure though. Oh, got hit combo too, huh? I kind of forgot about that one. My turn. Alright, into the GG. My turn. 
I shall go forth. Now, now let's slash go. And dash. Yeah. Let's try our best. Stop healing yourself. Who's the target? This is very easy. I shall go forth. Goodbye. We won. We won. W I N. Oh, I got a 102 hit combo. I wasn't worried about the combo one because uh, apparently that one you can easily do with one of the uh, Vert's skills or something. She does uh, over 100 hits all on her own, apparently. The 100k damage was the tougher one. Yeah, Vert's next Forbes EXE attack apparently does over 100 hits all on its own. We're about out of things to do on this playthrough, aren't we? We have to go to our through and then play through soon. I'm Cisha. You can rely on me. Go back to my party. Still want to do the rest of the. Below 90 or 100 all seeds for fun. Whoa, we got both. What should I do? Not all right, into the specimen book. It doesn't matter if you don't accept it. This is a reality. Alright. Into the specimen defeated. Yes. There's something. Oh, wait, I read the one. Grats! Thank you, thank you, thank you! Pretty much all the things left to do require the uh, true ending playthrough. The only thing we can really do on this playthrough still is 100 different items developed. We could do that. Or we could get 100 items from dungeon objects. But since we have to do hidden treasures anyway, there's. We might as well just wait for the dungeon objects until next playthrough. This hidden treasures has to be done on the true ending playthrough. And the best disc for the di two disc related trophies is on the true ending playthrough. So, 100 items developed is pretty much the only other thing I can think of to do on this playthrough. Hi, DeRay. Oka, Oka. Good for nothings. That's right. He's good for nothings. Let's go one on one. Leave it to me. I've been waiting. All oh, right, he's the guy with the stupid cape. Now, who to choose? You're in the way. Don't underestimate me. Let's nip things up. The cape you can't hit because it's high up. I forgot. Kill you. Now, who to choose? Let's nip things up. I've been waiting. It is my turn. You're not half bad. I'll be serious. Now, who to choose? Can't move. All right. I call this Umio Heaven. I didn't have Umio Heaven when I did Afi Mojos before. It does hit him. Good, good, good. How was Elden Ring? It was very cool. I saw many strong enemies.
defeated a few bosses. Probably baby bosses, but still. Can I get him? I broke a part. Did I break the part I needed to break, though? I shall go forth. I did not break the part I needed to break. <clears throat> Was it hard? Not really. Only the bosses so far. Mm, I don't think I can do anything for you. I'm just gonna take a nap here. Wait, I could probably do that, right? No, I can't. She can't. She has to wait for her. Walking thing to wear off. Let's go. Yeah. All right, into the specimen book. I feel like pudding would work. It hits from above, right? Oh, come on. It's kind of bullshit. Now, who shall I talk? My turn. I shall go for <laughs> Just kidding. My turn. Omeo, light him up. I have more skills so I can hit from above this time, I think. Oh, that didn't get him. Does that not get the cape? Come on, now. Maybe I was breaking some other part. Ooh, that hit, but it didn't do anything. Intriguing. Fucked him up. Capes got done, man. He does now. He's toast now. House, buddy. As soon as I get your ice pretty zip, bro. You're toast.
GG. You give CPU chips? That ain't worth it. Just go break the things in the forest for that. Uh oh, I get to fight your 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 the good guys now. You wanna play with me? Leave this to me. Fighting myself? Oh ba. Fun to beat myself up. Yeah. Let's nip things up. Well, oh, you guys are too low level. You're pretty tanky, though. Pro versus pro, which pro will win? I think I'll win. She doesn't even have the cool, like, second outfit I got on. The purple hoodie. She's got the white hoodie. She's not gonna win. She's not nearly as stylish. And she does no damage, so. That's probably the bigger reason. Easy. Well, it's the Warren Uni's turn to get beat up. Fight everybody. How dare you support yourself? I'll finish it this time. I think that was a bug. I'm a force of fury. To the chest. No way, finally. What should I do? Bad, accept it. I'm too low level for me. I'm still pretty tanky at level 70 is the recommended level. I presume they're about 70. Still pretty tanky. I'm first because she's a healer. She didn't even heal herself. What? I'm 
actually doing damage. What is this? She's using a skill though. She's not using a regular attack. Taking this seriously. What should I do? Um, I'm still here, so. Mad, mad. What should I do? Healing power. Nice timing. I'll end this all. Don't know me. The other pro last a bunch. True. I shall go for it. Now, who should I find? I'll nip you all. I'm a force of fury. Let's go. Okay. Not bad. I'll be serious. I need to heal. You can't do that, right? But you can't heal. You're not allowed to heal. I can heal as much as I want, but you not. It's tougher because she actually used her skills. Bert and Uzuba. Oh my gosh. That's what the swirly are. <laughs> she dizzy. Doesn't seem to have a status effect though. I have fed Kampa. Oh no. It's my turn. Are pitting just mere humans against us? My turn. Oh my gosh. It's pretty tanky for a human. She's not nearly that tanky when she's in my party though. Go for it. Maybe I should have put them in my 
sniper. Yes, yet. Oh, okay. Oh, well, uh, this don't look like hell to me. Look, I'm on the TV. I'm gonna beat all the franchise characters. Only the mobs will be left. This goddamn rut. It's rut. Think I will. Oh, it's all the gold thirds. I was expecting that one. They're coming from above. Watch out. Serious. <laughs> My turn. They aren't quite as beefy as the duos. Probably because there's four of them, so they gave them less defense. Those long skills, yeah. She got. Uh, don't they do long ass skills in Final Fantasy? She's got to be representative. Any fives now? I won't lose this battle. Who's this cutie pie? It looks like the guy from that the uh, dungeon I was just in to get the uh, ninety nine. I 
shall go forth. <laughs> Just kidding. Hell yeah! It's like a Pokemon. What should I do? Yes. I'm a force of fury. Don't mess with me. To the chest. What should I do? Nintendo's gonna get them right now. Big nap below. And heart. What I no item. Dark. Easy, easy. GG. That's right. Wait, just kidding. You can't just say just kidding. Get some stuff off. Who's this? Well, these are these are basically just enemies from that dungeon I was just at where I got 99. I've been waiting. Probably slightly weaker versions. Right. The recommendation for these is 75. The ones in the dungeon were 95. So. Up giant Pokemon. Another Pokemon, maybe from a different game. Well, like you said, it's Pokemon, not Pokemon, so it's not Pokemon. It's Pokemon. Totally different. Oops. Mean to defend. What should I do? What should I do? Finally. Here we go. You're so naive. I'm not one to get carried away with this victory. <laughs> Like she's getting carried away with this victory. Cool. Sky Wars, not Star Wars, Sky Wars. Dark Vader Wars. I gotta protect the others. What should I do here? You guys are all separated. I guess we'll just defend until you come over. Into the 
Hot dog is beefy. Kind of annoying, aren't you? You'll heal yourself once you're half health. be able to kill you. Good question. Nope. Let's see how healthy he heals himself. Oh, this can be annoying. Resistance is useless. Uh, Leave this to me. 
Doesn't do much. I am the My turn. Let's go. Gotcha. Oh, not gonna be enough. <laughs> well, the hell are we gonna kill this thing? You're in the way. This is kind of bullshit, honestly. Right. Into the specimen book. Hmm, our physical defense, huh? Power up with my madness. It's my turn. This is all allies in range. You bitch. I was wondering if you were going to. Uh, bitch. That still doesn't even do half. I don't know how the fuck I'm gonna kill this fucking thing. It lowers physical defense though. Keep it stunned or something? There's... I don't have anybody who can stun. Well, actually... Well... It has to be, like, paralyzed. Element. This guy's broken. Level 75 fight, by the way. even have the ability. Come throw all I got at you. I don't know if I have anything too stun. This guy's kinda bullshit, gotta say. Only level 75 recommended for this fight? Like, what? You're crazy. Right. 
Java Sadaka happen. Oh, close. Let's nip things up. I need to get enough crits, honestly. But I need. He's gonna heal again, cause uh, what's required to get back to four? Yep. You guys rigged. Level 75 recommended fight, by the way. Let's nip things up. Where are my options? Maybe I should swap out Neptune for Ram and see if he, I do more with uh, elemental attacks. Here we go. Only thanks to you. I gotta hold it. Switching out the pro tag? Really? I'm gonna wrap this up real quick. Uh, we'll see about that. Yeah. Holy shit! I actually do damage. You were unlucky to fight me. <laughs> we did it, Rob! We won! Uh, super strong against physical defense, but really weak against elemental. The guy's rigged. What about CPU forms? Ooh, true, I could have done that too. I probably would have been enough. You got stuff for it, huh? A weapon for IF and big nap. The weapon we got for big that is weaker than what we currently have. I feel ripped off. The weapon we got for I wait wait wait. The weapon we got for IF is exactly the same strength. Both 350. They don't seem to have any noticeable difference. No elemental difference or anything. What's the difference? Or just, just the attack pattern. I guess that's it. I said I was gonna do all the ones but till a hundred. You're at a hundred. We'll try you. How about that? Let's do our best. Ow. Leave it to me. You're a jammer, so I can't do shit, right? What I do? I'll end this all. You can do it anything. I'll do it. Hiding back there. do well against these guys too because machines are weak against elemental attacks.
Can I do those? No. Oh, I can still do my. Oh wait, never mind. The 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 the. They're like, fuck you. you can't do shit. You got skill gemmers. Seems I have to beat these guys up with regular attacks. You go die in a corner. Oh, you're running away. You can't run away. up after that. Then you start getting the other ones. That are DLC ones. Although this one's probably a DLC one. All the 100 plus ones are probably the DLC ones that I saw in the store that were free. And I was like, oh, I'll download them. I didn't realize I needed to be like level 5 bajillion to actually do these fights. These aren't happening, obviously. See, let's do the 999. Let's do it. We can totally win this one. Oh, well. Oh, I think I lost this one. I got survived with four. I, uh, everybody's dead. Uh, there's one with four HP. This is easy. Got whopped, huh? Well, that's crazy. Look how high level these bitches are. And that's all I got for beating them. Some stuff I could just get. Well, I don't know what the ultimate jewel is, but it's probably not worth it. <laughs> GG. Lit up to a hundred. Uh, that's good. I consider Coliseum Concord. Ah, 21 out of 48. Honestly, the ball one's probably DLC as well. So it's probably 20 fights. Hero Toasted. That's what happens when you go up against the 999s when you're not 999. That's what happens. It's so sad. So tragic. Mm, yeah, I was making pigments and stuff. Well done. That's what I was doing for item development, right? I was working on the pigments. Oh wait, now I remember what I was doing before last time. I made the uh, twig or something, right? 
Ooh, I can make this. Whatever we can make. I doubt these weapons are actually any good. Usually the best weapons are in Coliseum, but uh, not this time, it looks like. Hmm, yeah, so you buy, like, a uh, max of all the pigments, and you go, like, make all these things. See how they all require colors? You go buy, like, one of all the, uh, outfits or whatever. And then you make all the things is how you do your item development this time, I suppose. I'm sure Pro finds a way to reach 999 easy. Apparently not. From what I've read, it's actually really grindy. Ain't no easy way to get to 999. It's a big grind. I presume it's a big grind on all the games, though, but in the previous Rebirth games, like, the level DLC you have to buy costs, like, what, 99 cents? Three dollars or something? I was like, I'm not buying no DLC just to get past level 99 cap. In this game, though, the d level DLC was free, so I went ahead and downloaded it. I went ahead and downloaded all the free Coliseum battles, but I'm, there's, I'm not going to 99. Way too grindy. Way, way too grindy. I could try either buying stuff and doing stuff without the two colors, or I could go get them. We'll try seeing how far we can get without the colors. too lazy to go get them. Do I need like one of everything? I need to buy everything once but on. As far as I'm willing to go. Really only gets me that first batch. Oh, you need ice clover for these as well. Oh, so I need two more. Chi whatever chi I don't know. Fuck you, it. Two ice clover. have red pigment. It's like there's three for cat ears hat. Let's go buy three cat ear hats. That sound adorable. If they're available. Oh, they're there.
much microtransactions while I play gotcha? That's right. You play gotchas for your microtransactions. That's right. I think there's three for everything. Three cat hat glasses, three doggoo hats. You can only do two purple friends because I don't have red pigment. I have a white corsage. I saw the Nepgear Dom one it too. How many of those I need though? Those look like they were only one though. Oh, I need some, like, other item for that. Never mind. <laughs> Screw that. Like, three strawberry ribbons. And three elegant crowns. I can only remember two things at a time, okay? Bell ribbons. It's like I can do these uh, paper ones though, because I've got enough of the regular items. How many are there? Three, four. Four of them and. Oh, wait, four of what? Uh, I already forgot what they're called. It's already gone. Low grade ribbon. Four low grade ribbons. Two bell ribbons. This, ta this trophy has actually been in all the uh, rebirth games in this game. Like make a make hundred items, develop hundred plans, or whatever they call it. It's always the same thing. Mm. I'm not making any of this shit. It's required a bunch of stuff. Mm. So black sailor, rosy sailor, green sailor.
And that's probably everything I'm getting here. Oh, I just noticed this sword I haven't made. Kiryu sword. A sword used by the one known as the Dragon of Dojima who lived in Planeptune. I didn't know Kiryu lived in Planeptune. Quick, where's Pyro? You gotta tell him this news. I bet he didn't know that. Prof T. That's funny. Chivalrous metal. <laughs> I haven't got- there's only one to own? I am, I wonder where it is. I can tell it's a rare thing. That's all I can make here. You got different items available at different towns. I think the items will be the same though. Make dragons fly, spear. Let's see. Hmm, I can't make that heart barrette now. I got one heart barrette, two morning morning. And two emerald. Right. How dare you? It's about snacky break time, isn't it? Oh, that other one's red pigment. I didn't notice. Butterfly ornament. One Agnes ribbon. An angel set. Hmm. Either these aren't here or I missed them. There's Angel set. Oh, they're, they're down toward the bottom. Dog ears. Black cat ears. But two white rabbit ears. Let's see, dog, black cat, white rabbit. Let's see if I can remember all that. White rabbit was two, right? There it happened to conveniently be down at the bottom. Easier to remember. Need a perfilium sword and game is toasted. That's goddamn right.
That's it for a lane box. Wait, I think I forgot about her dresses on the other one. Ooh. That's fine. One sapphire ribbon. Two pointy ribbons. Two fine blue ribbons. No, one fine blue ribbon. Oh, Sapphire or A5. These exist. Probably do. I'm just too lazy. Oh, uh, there's pointy. I found the too lazy to look through the list. For that. Ooh. Three last station patrol. And three white cat ribbon. I'd be getting close to a hundred, right? There we go. Ida Meister trophy earned. I knew it. Knew we were getting close to a hundred. Light blue. Ooh. I'm full of energy. Didn't think so. This is Keisha. I'll do my best. I haven't saved in ages, I just realized. I haven't saved for almost two hours. Phew. What if my power went out, man? And I'd be like, mm -hmm. I'm out of things to do that don't involve going to New Game Plus, except maybe, like, dungeon objects, but... I might as well do that next playthrough. Damn it. Damn it. I guess it's time to read up on how to do true and then play through. 
let's go be up the final boss again and get over there. First though is Snackle Break. We're gonna take Snackle Break and then we're gonna go beat up final boss. Go to New Game Plus and the uh, read up on what we need to do to do trending playthrough. And then do it. I might finish this game next week. I don't think we got enough time today because it'll probably take a few hours just to play through the story again. Let's do whatever else I need to do. The game might be done next week. Oh my. Oh me. Oh me, oh my. Am I crazy? For now though, for tonight though, it's snack go time. One step at a time, right? Well actually, wait, there's hidden treasures too. I feel like those hidden treasures might take a while. We'll see, we'll see. Oh yeah, I have to have the scout search and stuff too. Okay, maybe two more shrimps. <laughs> we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. In the meantime though, BRB! Alright. The time has arrived. To beat up the final boss again and go to New Game Plus. So we can start doing... True ending stuff. For Zero Dimension, we the only thing we got to do is uh, just watch all the cutscenes and we're guaranteed to not miss whatever the cutscene was we needed. The only downside is you have to watch all the cutscenes again. Be the cutscenes about Uzume's memories of East War, but since you don't know when those are, it'd just be safer to watch them all. At least in my opinion. Wait, let's go be up a final boss again. Let's go. Give it my all. Give it I'll give it my all too. Watch this. Oh, you dead. These are the best weapons. I feel like the best weapons for everybody would open up the combos for everybody. Hmm. Mega Dimension and Optonia. Best weapons. They're full combos. Where should we go? <clears throat> beep, beep, beep. The only way to get him is item development. For Nep Gear, it's Plasma Blade, huh? Let's try going here. I'm tired. We need three illegal techs. <laughs> oh wait, is it this one actually? Possible sword. Oh wait, this one's lists the uh, the combos. Not that. I got all the cool circles. Hmm. Game slicer's open, but it's weak. I can't believe this. Wait, the first stuff's open? <laughs> Actually, the weapons might depend on where you are. I think this would be the place for Napgear though. It probably is that. It doesn't have everything open. Hmm. 
<laughs> I'd like a younger sis like Nepgear too. I wonder if Nepgear would like to become my sis. Well, I guess we're not doing that. The best, best stuff involves getting the 999, of course. And back, how was the tasty? Was it tasty? Yeah, very tasty. Stretch, okay. We got tasty food here. I was looking to see uh, if I could get a weapon for Nepgear that had a full combo open, but uh, it sure don't look like it. Her ultimate weapon requires a jewel that you have to be level 999 for. Her shell ain't doing that. In fact, she's gonna be living with what she got the rest of the game. The rest of the run. It's good enough. I just like spamming swear. I'm just greedy. Let's, try going here. Let's go beat up final boss. I choose you. I'm tired. Here's what it is. <clears throat> the good ending. Yeah, we've done everything we can do on this first playthrough. Now we gotta go beat the final boss and start our true ending run. Definitely won't finish it today, though. One of the requirements for true ending is to... Uh, uh, watch specific cutscenes in the beginning. And since I don't know which cutscenes those are, I don't want to. I'm not going to skip any cutscenes in the zero dimension ch section. So, we're going to be watching all those. Won't that be exciting? Actually, what's the button? The, what's the button? The watch cutscenes. There's an auto button somewhere. In square or circle. We're going to find out. And then we have to do stuff in the hyperdimension chapter to uh, raise the shares of every nation to 40% for special cutscenes. And Neptune's got to go to 60% shares. Shares is that thing you see in the bottom corner here. Bottom block column. Everybody's at 100 except Neptune right now. But those don't carry over the next playthrough anyway, so it doesn't matter. All right, it's time to go beat up final boss. Let's try going here. It's time to begin the the, the journey. The second and final playthrough. Yeah. Looks like we win this match. Look how big, cool. Damn, if I can ever get over there. Oh, you guys want that? Yeah, I finished this stylishly. Why oh, got one dollar? Two more steps and I get another fight. Let's try going here. Whoa! Almost made it. Now well, let's get to it. Like a wallaby. 
we'll say bye bye big nep again we'll be with nepker and who's the mega you kids play big nep full time till close to the end of the game don't you oh man Leave it to me, it must be for jumping. Why you guys wanna die? You're doing like zero damage. What are you guys doing? Wait, you stuck? Let's nip things up. Maybe I should have. We won. We won. W I N. That's right. All right. Uh, ready anytime. You got in the way. I'm sorry. Well, I am this all. All right. All right. You yeah. take some of the flash and dash. What should I do? No, oh, it defends and I can't reach anybody. Yeah, right. I'm sorry to slap. I'm just glad I finished what I started. Let's go. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, Auto is triangle. Then we'll take that CPU's power. Okay. We obtain the power this auto button. Dimensions and stop the fusion. So that's the plan. I don't know if skip is safe. We'll do auto. Be able to do something about this, but even if we defeat her, not for that for her. And this is cool. Yeah, her. Sharing. Hmm, can't pause during skipping. I do it. Next cutscene's like five seconds anyway. Fearsome. I'm scared. What do I do about this? I'll cut through distortions with my Panzer Blade. Yeah. My turn. I don't like the fun. Did you see, she just says she doesn't fight for fun. I don't buy that. I'm from our Umio Heavens. Too good for a final boss this time. I'll go calmly. Down, go! We need 35 umios again. I feel I'll take fewer than that this time. What is this robot? All right, the final strike. Who's my opponent? Flash. 
There's 20 Umios this time, right? Nah, I'm probably still 35, right? Finally. Hmm. I'll keep you here. Holy shit, she actually did some damage against somebody. I'm not sure who. Alright, four mismatch for that. Hmm. What we can do next form. Let's do it. Okay. I don't fight the sun. Child's play. It's Uzumi's turn. Hmm. There needs to be a line for these two. Hee 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 hee. I'll go first. No, you saw right. Tear through! Panzer Blade! Yeah! Yeah! My turn. Hmm. I mean, two for that. Yeah. I'll carry the weight with you next gear. All right, go. After parting with Uzume. Rip. GG.
Star and no gun plus. Let's do it. Oh, you can choose what to carry over, huh? Yeah, carry over everybody, man. Why would you want to reset your levels or whatever? Really? No, I don't want items. No, 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 I don't want my items. Yes, I want my items. Check mark everything. All good. Give me the things. Topic that are checked will be continued. Okay, yes. Those are all the ones that uh, are right from the DLC. That I'm never gonna play because I'm not gonna go to like 999. Mm, I was right. That ball was a DLC one. He he he. So I did one DLC fight. Okay. How long has it been since this world and I were swallowed by this dark vortex of delusion? Uh oh. Except it didn't swallow me. It was my doing. I threw myself willingly into this maelstrom. But it's pulled me down deeper. And with more violence than I could have ever imagined. How can I see this boundless world full of delusion? Give me an answer. Anyone, please. Save me. Very dramatic opening cutscene. I forgot all about it. Not many DLC. Bro. Not many. Game industry. A world which exists outside of our reality where four CPUs protect and rule above each nation. The nation where CPU Purple Heart rules, Planetoon. The nation where CPU Black Heart rules, Last Station. The nation where CPU White Heart rules, Loewe. The nation where CPU Green Heart rules, Leanbox. In the past, Game industry had been exposed to threats such as the Deity of Sin and the CPU of the ancient nation of Tari. But thanks to the efforts of the four CPUs, a lasting era of peace has been maintained. However, as they enter the CPU shift period, their enduring reign is approaching its end. Uh oh. No, that's your city after bad politicians. Uh-oh. Napping the warmth of the planet Toon Sun is the best. Although, I kind of feel like I just had a super creepy dream. Ah! What was that noise? If I didn't know any better, I'd say that sounded like something plastic slamming against the concrete. Hmm. I think it came from over there. Maybe I should go take a look. Uh-oh. Getting yourself in trouble now. And so, here we find our heroine in a spooky back alley, shrouded in darkness in the middle of the afternoon. Yeah, this isn't weird at all. Someone, save me! Huh? Is that a voice? It's your light novel Someone, mode. Anyone, save me! Save the zero dimension! Yeah, that's what the story is, light novel mode. We've been in we've been in fight mode so long, you forgot about light novel mode, huh? Answer me! That's so weird. I could have sworn I heard it coming from around here. Hmm? Wait. What's this on the ground? It almost looks like a game console? 
But who even makes this? It's got a white body, a swirl mark. Even a sophisticated game sommelier like myself has never seen anything like this. Well, I don't see anyone around here, so I guess I'll just take a... I mean, deposit this at the Basilicon. Get the deposit, not... Not stealing, it's depositing. Hey, Nepgear, looky look! I found a super cool vintage game console. Oh, really? Maybe we can try playing it later. Also, welcome home, Neptune. I'm glad you made it back safe and sound. This kid is Nepgear. She may seem older, but don't be fooled. She's my little sister. The CPU candidate of the nation, Planetune. Neptune, where in game industry have you been? This is not the time to be goofing off. I will not forgive you today. Ah, it's Isti! This small fairy-looking girl is Istoire, or Isti, as I like to call her. Planetune's first CPU created her in order to keep a record of the nation's history and, right now, she acts as Planetune's oracle. She's cute till she opens her mouth and turns into a little dictator. It's a character flaw that I'm gonna talk to the writers about soon because he... Neptune, listen to me. We're in the midst of the game industry's shift period, and this is simply not the time for brash behavior. Ah, uh, come on, Isti, lighten up! It's just a little old shift period. Wait, what is that again? Even though I have explained it so thoroughly, I will explain it once again. So please, listen. The CPU shift period is the season when citizens begin searching for new CPUs to follow, instead of placing their faith in those already presiding. We're currently in the window of time when rumors about the CPUs will begin circulating, tarnishing their reputations. In fact, at this very moment, the other CPUs have been working relentlessly to prepare specialized teams to counter any allegations. I'm totally fine. This is Planetune we're talking about, Isti. My people love me. Besides, isn't Noir the only one who's made an actual team? Bert has that MMO tourney, and Blonde has Rookie Novelist Awards coming up soon. Dear me. Why is it that all the CPUs lack a mature and appropriate sense of danger? Hey! Don't just lump me in with those lazy idiots, Eastwar! Oh, by the way, this girl is Noir, the CPU of Last Station, the nation next door. She's a friendless, lonely soul, aren't you, Noir? You shut up! I'm not lonely! Yeah, I'm not lonely! Just the way the cookie I'm enjoying this again. Neptunior, think you can fix this? Cause it's cool. I'm not sure if I can. It doesn't look like technology I'm familiar with. May I inspect it for a moment, Big Sis? <sighs> it cannot be helped. It appears I will be constructing a solution on my own for Planetune's safety yet again. Anyone, please. Save us. <laughs> yet again. Sold to me again. Renoir, you have billions of friends. That's right. Did you hear that? Oh, I knew I heard something earlier. Good work, Neptunior. Where's it coming from? This is gonna sound weird, but I think the voice came from inside this console. Oh! Yikes! What in the what is this? Why are we getting swallowed up in our own room? What should we do? I can't move! Neptune! We're, We're getting, getting sucked in! in. Ah! Again. Ooh, Katsu.
totally normal. You get sucked by some console any day. That's right. Just the end of the game. This is the start of New Game Plus. We have to do a true ending playthrough. We've done everything we can do on the first playthrough, so now we have to do New Game Plus to get the rest of the trophies. We're getting toward the end, though. Probably one or two more streams. I'm thinking two more streams. Junior, give me ten more minutes. This isn't the time to be sleeping. Look, look around. I want to sleep. Uh, you're so noisy. Wait, did Isti find out we're slacking off to fix that console? Has she finally morphed into a bloodthirsty demon? Huh? Oh, right, right, right. This is just a dream. Okay, well then, night nap gear, turn the lights off on your way out, okay? Oh, it's not a dream, Neptune. Get up! No, 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 this can't be possible. I mean, we were just in our room, right? Why would we suddenly be in a place like this? I don't know. When I came to, we were just here. What happened? Well, I don't really know where this is, but I don't think it can be helped. The city's collapsed, there are weird cracks in the sky, but, you know, this is totally a normal occurrence in games. Uh, Neptune, even if it happens often in games, this should not be happening here, in reality. Reality? Let's not sweat the small stuff, all right? Hey, there might be some NPCs out and about. Let's go for a walk. I'm sure that'll be ten times better than moping around in a place like this. Yeah, you're right. It's better than just waiting around for an event to appear. That's the spirit. Let's go. <clears throat> Maybe in the flag item rocket jumping is jumping extremely high in certain dungeons. Okay. Maybe when the flag item is sturdy heart, you will avert game over from within the plunker dungeons and simply return to the world map? Ooh. Where where do I get these flags? And if I got them dash sneakers, you can move more quickly than the. <gasps> yeah, but you gotta tell me how to get these things. And even the flag item help button, you know, and you look at the help topics that teach me is the opening movie will replay. That's cute. Enabling the flag item dark orb, you'll no longer encounter enemies on the world map. And where do I get all these things? Are they available immediately at New Game Plus or something? By enabling the flag item, please look! When viewing character models, such as in the equipment menu, the character will glance towards you. <laughs> um, okay. Um, this sounds like it's pandering to some certain individuals. I heard the voices on the console and it sucked us in. Isn't like we wanted to go anyway. That's right. I heard Uzuma asking for help. You're worried about me? Thanks. Why am I hearing like blonde? Wait, um, where are the? I don't remember where to label the things. Oh, over here. Oh. <gasps> oh yeah. Greatly jump high. Now we can't get game overs in the plunker dungeon. We can walk faster. I don't care about the teach misty. Prevent world map battles. I'm curious about the please look. Do you gonna look now? I'm gonna look your way. Oh wait, I do have everybody. I see, I see. I see, I see, I see. Oh, it's very slight. She only just slightly moves her eyes. Just like like a millimeter. It looks like she's looking right at you. I'm scared. We have to turn that one off. It's too terrifying. So I can actually have the entire party. Wow, I actually can. I thought I was gonna have to unlock everybody again. 
Because I'm pretty sure that's what I, you had you had in the previous games. Uh, who gets the what? I don't know. What's round guard? Ah, cool. Oh well. I don't have enough lily rag for everybody to get their stuff. Will it? I don't really care though. Mages are waiting to attack. If need be. I gotta put it, the the good stuff back on the. Oh, I forgot about that thing. Does it hit me well? I don't know. Does it? Put everyone's good stuff on. Just in case I need them. I probably shouldn't though, because everyone's available right at the beginning. Not certain people at certain times, so. Give me back my koala. Pudding hat. Oh yeah, cookie. Hmm. <laughs> Are they watching our souls, our intentions? That's right. Ah. The, the cat ears, right? Who's the person walking around? You. Neptom. I, I refuse to put that on. A lot of just stays on until I turn it off, I guess. I didn't have to turn it on. Cool. Weird. You'd think there would at least be a cat, a hologram, or something. Hey! Anyone here? There's something really eerie about this place, Neptune. Those cracks running through the streets and buildings don't seem like regular cracks. You're right. They're all green and pretty. I feel like if I stared at them long enough, they'd suck me right in. There are similar cracks in the sky, too. It's almost as if the fabric of space and time itself has cracks in it. And these buildings, they feel familiar. Kind of like some of the ones we have back in Planetune. N no it couldn't be. Hmm. Would Planetune look like this if we were to enter an apocalypse? Don't say things like that! That's bad! When I look more closely, I don't recognize any of these areas. So I don't think it's Planetune. Doi! Come on, little Nep. That city's my backyard! I'd recognize it if I was walking around it blindfolded! Well, it does us no good to keep brooding here. Forward march! Where does her confidence come from at times like this, I wonder? My confidence, you ask? It's obviously because I'm the main character. No matter what happens, we'll make it through with my protag rule set. I hope so. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> that was just k kinda loud, is all. <laughs> it's just a run of the mill first battle baddie. See, Neptunior? My protag rule set has found local person number one. 
No, Neptune! No matter how you look, I don't think we can converse with it. It's full of murderous intent. Uh, I guess so, huh? <laughs> and here I thought we'd finally run into someone else besides us. But if the enemy is raring to go, we've no choice. Nepgear, let's transform and stop it. Right! Behold my power! Processor unit, set! Um... Uh-oh. But... nothing happened? Can't transform. <clears throat> oh no. Ah! Hey, that's dangerous! Oh, I see. You don't know it's against the rules to attack during a transformation sequence. I don't think a monster will understand, even if you tell them that. I don't know why we can't go HDD, but we have to take care of the enemy in front of us first. Let's go for it. Okay. Oh, Neptune, I've seen the prostate too. Oh, man. So when I get these fights, I have to have certain characters in the front, huh? Oh, my gosh. Oh yeah, this I, this screen doesn't really matter in first playthrough. I guess it's more of a New Game Plus screen. Let's start the tutorial battle. Everyone, use this fight to learn the basics, all right? Okay, it's a promise. I've never seen this monster before. It looks strong. I'll have to focus. Never fear, Nepgear. This is a tutorial battle, so no matter how crazy they look, we'll win. Okay. What should right. I should right. Sorry. See? I can do it if I try. All right. Woo! Easy peasy. We didn't even need HDD. But why couldn't we transform? Oh! What's up, Neptunior? Neptune, it's our shares! I thought something was weird. I can't feel our shares at all. Yeah, right. I trounced a certain noir in a character ranking contest. That popularity is like the source of our shares. So, to be missing... <laughs> That's... ridiculous. It's gone. What? Why? Shares are the faith people have in CPUs. It's impossible for them to be at zero. And for us to be unable to transform in a post-apocalyptic horror world like this, we're going to be sterilized. But please, calm down, Neptune. Also, that monster we just fought? Have you ever seen anything like it before? That super gross mutant bug thing? Nope. And I kinda wish I never had. What about you? It was my first time too. Unfamiliar monsters in an unfamiliar land. Where the goodness are we? Can we actually get out of here alive? I've tried contacting Eastwar, but the end gear keeps dropping out of range, so I can't connect to the phone or the internet. It it'll be just fine. You worry too much. Just leave everything to your big sis. And let's be real here. Roaming around strange new lands beating up monsters is way better than working at a boring desk. Neptune, I think you only feel that way because you hate working. <laughs> the only thing I hate All is out. not having fun. Come on, let's make the most of this little sis. Neptune, I don't know if I can have fun. But I'm sure we'll be fine if we're together. There we go. You look way cuter when you smile. Let's keep moving. Okay. Just can't move on. Ooh, look how fast I go now. Woo! Like a Woo! I can break these now. Pick that. Hmm, how do I get up to you? Around, I say. Ooh, check this out. I wonder what happened here. 
Hey, Nip Jr., let's try climbing to the top. Maybe we can figure out where we are. Okay. Wait for me, Neptune! This can't be... What? What? What, what is this? No way. Just where is this? You can't take it seriously with the cat ears, sorry. Is it another chapter for the Neptune? Don't mention the pudding, though. Let's give it five minutes. Oh no! She's surrounded by a bunch of scary monsters! There's no way a local could fight against that many. Let's go, Nepgear. Yeah, let's go help her! Mm, it's time to pick up the controller. Actually, can you have both active? That's a good question. <clears throat> oh, it does say only in certain dungeons, doesn't it? When did I get this? But not in general, just certain dungeons. I wonder which ones qualify as certain dungeons. Like some end game dungeons. Probably. Ooh, an item. Jump. Here you go. Ooh, an item. What? I missed a treasure back there. Sometimes the hidden uh, treasure requirements are to find all treasure, so. I should probably just start scouting and find out. We don't get scouts for a bit yet. Actually, man, unless they carry over to New Game Plus. Maybe that. Here you go. Here you go. Oh, you see this? This is what the other trophy is, is get a hundred of these items from boxes. And I was like, eh, we'll do it in New Game Plus. We gotta destroy boxes anyway. Maybe it'll carry over between playthroughs, I don't know. We didn't even get the trophy for halfway, so... We still had a good way to go. Tough guys. Yeah. Beat him up. Ugh, these pricks are still crawling out of the woodwork. We're about halfway through evacuation. I'd advise you start heading back now. What the hell? Are you freaking kidding me? Half? We need to get them all out of here. Besides, if I leave these bastards alone, they're just gonna be on our tails all night. This is gonna end right here. Uh. Dear me, just don't overdo it. Yeah, yeah, I got it. I'm the only one who can fight anyway. Hey, yeah. Uh. Hmm? We found our first citizen. Hey there, people. I could have sworn there were a lot more monsters before we got here. Did she defeat them all by herself? Man, I'm just glad we finally ran into someone. Hey, lady, could you tell us where we... Oh, reinforcements now of all times? Come again? Uh-oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Chill out, lady, I'm just trying to... <laughs> You're not half bad. The name's Uzume Tenoboshi. What's yours? <laughs> Neptune! It's Neptune! Nep... 
Your name's freaking hard to pronounce. I get that a lot. Hmm, you're a lot stronger than you look. You're like the perfect prelude to it. Dang it, just listen to me. We're already super tired from getting sucked into that crazy vortex and I'm just trying to get back. Sorry, but I'm not the type to get all cozy with the enemy. If you think you can fool me by pretending to be human, you've got another thing coming. We're not enemies. Just listen to me. Seriously? What up? I know I'm number one on Game Industries Hot 100 chart for nicest people ever, but I'm about to get super pissed off. Game it? Ugh, what the hell are you even talking about? Eat this! Chest Buster! Stop! Huh? huh? Please stop, you two! Um, your name was Uzume, yes? Like my sister said, we have no intentions of fighting with you. In fact, I'd be really happy if you could help us. So, um, can you just listen to us for a minute? We aren't going to attack you, I promise. Yeah, what's your problem? Just help us, jeez. Neptune, this is your fault, too. Why are you picking fights with strangers? Uh, <laughs> my bad. I was getting a little too hyped. Stop in your ass. Still a few stragglers. All right, whoever you girls are, this is going to have to wait until I clean this up. Yeah, let's mop this spit up. I wanted us to stop fighting. It's too late for that. Here we go. Oh boy. All right, step right up, you ugly sacks of flesh. My name is Uzume Tanoboshi, and you're all already dead. Leave this to me. We rock. To meet totally a girls meeting. Yeah, we totally just get in fights on our first meetings and be like, ah, who are you? Ah, rah, 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 rah. You're right. Yeah. Uh, Akira's the only one with common sense. That's been that's been that way since her first game, which was Rebirth 2. Is it really over? I guess I'll think She's been the only one with common sense since Rebirth 2, okay? I'm not sure what it is, but like I said before... Wait, I think she was introduced at the end of Rebirth 1, wasn't she? Like there were special things at the end where you awakened your I can't believe sisters it. or whatever if you had enough shares or whatever. I don't know. Tell you. It's been a while. The bad guys. No, I know. I didn't mean it like that. It's just, I can't remember the last time I've seen people, let alone fight alongside them. It was wrong of me to attack you the way I did. Please, forgive me. It's okay. I'm just so glad you believe us. Oh, it's all good, Uzume. I know how it goes. I'm just relieved to know there are other people roaming around these parts. Well, I'm actually the only other person here. That aside, if you're not its underlings, who the hell are you girls? You seem pretty strong, but... Hmm... We're... How do you say... Lost. We suddenly found ourselves in this city. We were looking around to see if there was anyone else. And we finally found you. Lost? You mean there are others who failed to escape and are surviving in other cities? Failed to escape? From what? Surviving? Hey! I thought we cleared the dungeon. How the dare they vibrate my control lower? Finally, it's arrived. It was enjoying its time on the desk. And now it's like... Brrr. What is that huge thing? Is the last boss already appearing? We didn't get blown to the end of the game or something, did we? I don't know. Yes, you did. That thing is either, but it's the one responsible for turning this city and the entire world into a wasteland. Is this the one behind all these weird cracks and rifts we've been seeing everywhere? Right, and it doesn't just destroy cities; it destroys the earth and sky as well. You're going to try and fight that? That's exactly right. 
I've been fighting with it for a long time. S something that giant is just too much. Please, Neptune, tell her to back down. All righty. Now I'm getting all fired up, too. Huh? Our opponent's bigger than a skyscraper? That's perfect. In fact, bring it on. <laughs> Junior, I'm the protag. There's no way I'll lose. I appreciate the gesture, Neptune, but this fight is mine and mine alone. It's useless to try and stop me. I staunchly refuse to listen to people all the time. I do what I want, and I want to help. Please be reasonable, you two. If you think about it sensibly, there's no way you could win against something that gigantic. Sorry to interject, but as a CPU, it's my sworn duty to deliver justice upon the one responsible for ruining this city. Huh? Hang on a sec. Did you just say you're a CPU? Oh yeah, I guess I hadn't mentioned that yet. Well, that doesn't really matter right now. This place is about to become a battlefield. If you're not prepared to get your hands dirty, then run. Far away. Uzume, let's get out of here together. I'm sure we can devise a strategy to defeat it that doesn't involve battling it head-on, so... No can do. A pack of monsters like the ones we just fought are advancing along with that giant. I gotta stop him here, no matter what. I need to create a window for the others to escape. That giant thing looks terrible enough, but a pack of monsters too? Also, what others? Well then, with courage like that, I'm even more pumped to help you out, Uzume. Let's get ready to rumble! Rumble! Fight like this, and you're just gonna hold me back. Like I said, just hurry up and get out of here already. I don't wanna run away. N no! Run away now. Who's gonna be here to help you? I'm not leaving you here to die. We're doing this together. Hmm? Besides, even if we really can't hold our own, we can at least buy you some more time. Neptune. Uh... Okay, you're right, Neptune. If you're going to fight, then I will too. Ugh, what freaking ever! You two are so dense. Fine then. Listen, if we're gonna be fighting this thing together, then know this. We fight to win. You two are so dense, says the person who wants to fight something larger than a skyscraper. Why don't we find a place where we can heal your wounds? From the looks of things, that giant won't head here immediately. We have some time. It's better to challenge it when we're at our best. You're not wrong. My base is close by, so let's head there. Now let's do what? Well. Say we have reached the end of voices. So low. Where did our professional paid voice acting go? Odd rate. Ooh, okay, okay. Well, hydrated. Seems pretty intense without the voices, and it's like it's kind of like a silent movie but with music, right? Just need that silent movie like visual effect from the old days. Spooky.
more dark without the voice lines. True, true. It's because you don't have Neptune being all like. Da -da 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 -da. Probably the MC did not make it look less serious. Oh my gosh. Neptune makes it look more serious, okay? How can you say he sounds handsome when there's no voice sack on one? Who ain't heard him yet? How'd they communicate over the the thing? Evacuation to a lot of people, but it's just do me all. I know, right? The story items that everybody should have. Oh, that's a bunch of stuff. Oh. Old enough for me to watch these, but we'll, we'll do it just in case. I'll watch all the cool things. No, that's item development. I see, I see. What? I can always get help by looking at help? No, no, what? No way. Look at all the galleries we got. Oh, they all locked. I guess they all are uh, turned off. Oh, the way. What? Oh, wait. I got all the cutscenes. Some of the CGs are locked up. Oh, key visual. So that's probably unlocked when you do something else. Ooh. Ooh. I guess you get the rest of the question marks with something else. Basically, a horde of monsters will approach the city before the giant does. We gotta get rid of the horde first. Gotcha. So all we gotta do is defeat any monsters that come here, right? Sounds simple enough. Right on. I'm counting on you, Nepsy. Yeah, they put some merchandise there. Oh, yeah, they did, didn't they? <laughs> and there it is. The usual and expected pattern of people I've just met being... Also known as Sony before they decided to be prudes. An adorable nickname, so I'm pumped. A pre prude era. Gearsy? Gearsy? Well, you can't both be called Nepsy, right? You'll be Gearsy. Gearsy. Gearsy, huh? <laughs> this might be the first time I've been given such a cute nickname. Welcome to the club, Nepgear. Go controller vibrating again. Come on, you two. <laughs> 
can't leave my control around the dash. Well, you're dead. Bye. That's right. Phew. I think we've taken care of all the monsters in the area. No, we've only endured the first wave. Here comes the second. It's a lot larger than the ones we just fought. <laughs> you bastard. Of course you would be here. What? Uzume, are you acquainted with this monster? <laughs> Oh, we're much more than acquaintances by now. We've faced each other so many times, we're practically a pair of rotten best friends. Whenever I have an opportunity to challenge the giant, this asshole just loves to get in the way. I can't count how many times he stopped me. Hey, you uh, might. He survives this fight, but didn't he? I don't remember what happened to him after that. Didn't he kind of fuck off? Hey, boy, took him out a second time. Differently, because I brought some friends with me who'd love to see you meet your end, along with that stupid giant. Share crystal, transform. Transformation complete. Th who, who are, are you? you? Hmm. <laughs> No need to thank us. We're friends now. I'd go to bat for you any day of the week. She's right. We're friends now. Um, so, what's your name, CPU Uzume? It's Orange Heart. That's so cool. I was really surprised by your transformation, Uzume. I thought you'd get even more aggressive in HDD form, but you're completely the opposite. I can't get over it. It's so crazy. Huh? Nepsy, why do you know about CP? Imagine being the Usame and transformed to not move a finger. There was so much going on. Dead before it's even her turn. CPUs too. What? Like for real? Don't play with me, Nepsy. Cross my heart. I am Purple Heart, the patron CPU of Planet Tune, able to leap giant dugoos in a single bound. I can even calm crying children. Except I kind of have no shares here, so it's not like I could transform and just show you. So, you're a CPU too, Kiersey? Yes, I am. Although, technically, I'm a CPU candidate. Wow, this is crazy! Never in a million years would I have imagined I'd run into CPUs in a desolate place like this! So cool! Oh, believe me, we're just as surprised. But I'm sure this is fate. You're totally right! Ran out of time. Ran out of time? Oh, right. It looks like you were using a share crystal to transform. <laughs> what the goodness? It's still alive? Damn it. You're a resilient bastard, aren't you? Do you want another beating, you idiot? Shoot. Any more of this is gonna be tough, even for me. But if it still wants a fight, then we'll keep going till the very end. It ran away? Bye, bitch! It's running away because of my intimidating... That's what I'd do if I was a monster. I'd be like, get the fuck out of here! I want to live! Neptune, I Shut up, Neptune. It's leaving because of its heavy lacerations. It's just hurt. I'm not satisfied that I couldn't finish it off. But now I can finally take on that giant. W wait just a second, Uzume. How can you be thinking of fighting that giant thing with those injuries? 
What's the matter, Nepsy? What happened to... We'll keep going till the very end. You know that's not what I mean. All I'm saying is you might not make it if you try fighting with those wounds. I'm just a monster with common sense. I know, right? Smartest monster in the game. It's like, bah! A surprise attack? How cowardly! Let's return the favor twofold, girls! It's our turn to debut! Ouch! Are you okay, Uzume? Did you get hurt from that explosion just now? You kidding? It takes more than that to take me down. Let's focus on how we can kill this thing. Oh, crap! Did everyone get out okay? It's me. What's your status? Have they all been evacuated? Uzume. We've just finished. We're in the next town over. Oh, good. We just made it. Yes. They're safe now. Thanks to you, Uzume. Then I can fight without reservations. Thanks for the update. Seems like everyone was able to escape safely. It's all because of you two. Thank you. Of course. But don't you think it's time we escape as well? Escape? I've been waiting so long for another chance at this giant. You just want to waste it? <laughs> Watch out! Huh? Phew! Just dodged it by the skin of our hairs. Neptune! Uzume! Skin of her what? Isn't that supposed to be skin of her teeth? It was too what the hell is skin of her hairs? But it looks like we're okay. Yeah, thanks to you, Nepsy. Dang it, Uzume. You really think it's a good idea to fight this thing when you're all beat up? Of course I do. Too risky. Let's get out of here while we still can. Shut the hell up. <laughs> I haven't had a shot like this in so damn long, and I don't expect you to get it, but I'm gonna fight. If you wanna leave, then just go. What are you saying? There's no way you can hold your own with that thing when you're so beat up. No, I can do this. I'm gonna fight even if the flesh is falling off my bones. Besides, I won't lose in a fight even if I die. Even if I have to go down with it, I'll... Yeah! Uh, ouch! What the hell are you doing? You can't do it alone, Uzume. Drop the tough girl act and live to fight another day. You know, they say where there's life, there's rope. R rope? I... I think she meant to say hope. Yeah, that's the word, hope. All the good little monsters were able to escape. Isn't that good enough for now? You don't need to push yourself, pal. Anyway, that's how it's gonna be. Nepgear, give me a hand here. Okay! Whoa! Hey! Let me go, you jerks! You can't just pick me up like this! Put me down! Got a good grip Kidnapping! Let's blow this pineapple stand. Hey! Listen to me, damn it! Oh, kidnapping. <sighs> Phew. I think this is probably far enough. Doesn't look like we were followed either. You idiots, getting in the way like that? How could you? You two know a CPU's sworn duty is to protect her people, and how could- Hey, Uzume, you're alive. A CPU also kind of needs to be alive to keep doing her job, you know? <sighs> yeah, I know. I guess I should be thankful, so thank you. <laughs> no need. I'm just glad you're here. Is there any place we could rest? We've all taken quite a beating. And we need to find a place to tend to Uzume's injuries. Yeah, let's head back to my base. Even now, it's out of the way of danger, and I have a lot of supplies we could use. And back to base! I choose you! Arst and Pace, voices. Alright, you gotta show it your final form. Nep just want another day for the pudding. That's right. She just wants to make it another day so she can have more pudding. And on these days, they need to put in like a storyline about giving Neptune pudding and then she eats it and then she's like, Ugh, because it's eggplant flavored pudding and she'll be feeling super betrayed and she'll never trust pudding ever again. Maybe that's a little sadistic of me. 
I think these might be some of the cutscenes they count. <clears throat> Conversation about Uzume's memories of East War. I don't know when the fuck that is. I think it's related to the ones that Neptune find or Nepgear finds when she's making the log though. I wouldn't be surprised if this one counts. You think about Uzume. Add piano time. Oh, but this one counts. I know once where she's like, eh, my memories. Who knows? The guy's just like, it doesn't point out a specific cutscene. It's just like, you won't miss it as long as you make sure to watch every zero dimension conversation. It's like, oh, cool, thanks. Real action starts in the when we get to the hyper dimension chapter. That's when we gotta do stuff to get the shares up. We can see special cutscenes. I'm sure that's the part where we failed. Because we don't skip cutscenes. So we definitely saw everything in the first playthrough. For this part. But uh, I definitely didn't get every nation to 40 shares to see special cutscenes with each of the CPUs. I definitely didn't do that. Especially not in that tunes because she has to get to 60 percent Because what is common in one area is super rare in another, and vice versa. There are spoilers for Rebirth too. We can't talk about Share Crystals.
It's two games ago. What do you think, cat? She thinks. Close her eyes. So she thinks. This one's long. Oh yes, definitely two streams. Maybe three streams. I forgot how long Zero Dimension is. Especially if you have to watch all the cutscenes because there's so much you might miss. It might be terrible. time to visit this place so the oh no not your pudding not your pudding not the pudding not the pudding <laughs> mm, hyper dimension never goddess is arc beside Neptune you get their shears to 40 percent Neptune you gotta get to 60 percent what 
Hmm. You just wait to ask to increase public relations. Easy. To the point where the event will trigger. Well, I have lots of money to invest in public relations, so. Presuming those have reset and aren't already, like, maxed out. Along with that, Noir has one quest that brings up her shares. Blonde has none. Virch's got two. Eptens is apparently the craziest. She's got four events you have to trigger. It involves doing three quests. And then getting the 60 shares. 60%. 60%. I do want to see what the bad ending was, too. Well, the only thing I have to do to make sure I get that is to not look at all those uh, dreams before you fight the four CPUs. We're going to do everything else, true ending style, and then we'll just save and skip the dreams and see bad ending, and then we'll reload save. And see the dreams, and then be cool. Be a good time. That'll be probably next time. We'll see. Guess it depends on how long it takes to do all the hyper dimension stuff. We'll definitely be past zero in hyper next time. What time is it? Two. Got some more time. Watch some cool. That seeds in silent movie mode. Cat keeps looking up toward the ceiling, but I don't see anything. She'll be looking up. She'll look up right now, and I'll be like, "Uh, what? I don't see anything. Still don't see anything. Maybe there's a spider up there the size of a breadcrumb. I don't know. Just totally investigate. Get the flashlight and be like, hmm, magnifying glass. Be like, hmm, what's going on? Oh, I thought I was about to have to pick up my controller. Never mind. Probably still looking for pudding. Oh, it's the first bath scene. Woo! Are we ready for the first bath scene? I don't just smell people. It's creepy. You don't just walk up and smell people. Did you never learn no manners, Uzma?
Yeah, 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 yeah. Bring on the good stuff. <laughs> Before Sony decided that, you know, adults couldn't make decisions for themselves and they had to make the decisions for them and censor things. This game is obviously before Sony decided to be pirating the, the adults in the room. The merchandise! That's right, the merchandise! Don't worry, there's like water and bubbles and shit. It's safe. It's safe. Twitch can't get you. Yeah, this is how you talk to people. Got water to save the water to the rescue. Damn it. Save bubbles. Rage! That's right. How dare they! Ah. I don't know what this game's rating is, but... Come on! Well, I'd probably get this game banned on Twitch. Twitch, Twitch doesn't like uh, visual novel games with nudity. They're fine with like uh, games like, I don't know, Witcher 3, Baldur's Gate 3, or whatever. There's nudity scenes, whatever. It's a visual novel style game, though. Nope. That's not cool anymore. Isn't that just an Aroga, you know? Just a hentai game. Ah! The save bubbles are to save the game from being able to still be on Twitch, okay? The nap cares tur uh they would No one's looking right, yeah. We're definitely not we're we're looking alright. Yeah, I'm looking at all the thing I wonder if the visual thinking of the four consumers cause this is kind of adorable in Japan. Yeah it is. Looks like this pretty adorable over there. Japan doesn't care that much about nudity. They're, they're, they're harder on violence, honestly. Like, violent video games. Meanwhile, over here it's like, bring on the gore. Oh my god, is that a boob? Sasha! It's for shame, right? For shame. Heheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheheh
Okay, bath scene's over. Party's over. Gotta wait for the next bath scene now. There's another one in this, uh, this zero dimension, I think. Yeah, these are the cutscenes I think are important. Ones where Nepgear's getting history information with her little end gear thing. I don't really specifically remember uh, Uzume having a scene where she remembered Eastwar specifically. Just like uh, her talking to Nepgear about Nepgear fighting and stuff, and then being like, Ah! My head! Ah! Do I remember something? I figure those are the, probably the cutscenes that matter. But I don't know when those pop up, so we get to watch all of them. Well, that'd be exciting. I doubt we'll get through all Zero Dimension today, but having to watch all the cutscenes. We we'll make our way through. We'll definitely be finished it next time. We'll be in Hyper Dimension. I think it'll take another stream to finish the game entirely though because we have to get all the hidden treasures and some of them uh, I don't think they carried over between playthroughs and some of them are uh, true ending only dungeons uh, or require they're, they require true ending because uh, there's dungeons that only open up in the true ending so I couldn't like get most of the treasures in the last playthrough and then finish it up in this playthrough I guess we'll see if they carry over, but I kind of doubt it. I'll probably have to get the ones I got last playthrough again. But those were the easy ones anyway, right? That's probably going to be my final trophy is getting all the hidden treasures. I'm excited. I think that'll require getting the hidden treasures in that black labyrinth area I was at earlier, wasn't it? Probably. There were treasures on the maps that I saw for each floor. I think I still have the pages open. Let's see. There isn't one for floor two, actually. One in floor three. Floor four. And floor one. There's three hidden treasures then, yeah. Dang it. I bet the scouts have to find all the dungeons again, too. Can we break the, break the sturdy roadblocks yet? We can! I can break all the blocks now. I got the, I made the bracelet like two streams ago for it. I can break anything now. Which will come in handy. I'll be able to get all the treasures in places now. Remember we left some paths? Yeah, we'll be able to do them all now. But I wasn't too worried about getting all the treasures and stuff because uh, I knew I couldn't get all the hidden treasures. Uh, I was like, eh, 
We can fully explore all dungeons on the next playthrough. Well, we're here! We're at next playthrough now! Woohoo! Alright, this is when they still think Obiels must be some handsome man. And before they find out he's a fish. Oh my god, what? I mean, a fish. I know, right? Did I spoil it for you? No, what? I found out also you can buy him as a DLC character if you want to. Remember the second minion we found was also a fish? Ooh, true. Pick up the controller. Ugh. Wait, we got this. She did have a form of fish. Close enough. Was a may a chicken, a fish. Fish ain't really meat. Fish is like fish. Chicken's not really meat either. Secondly, it's poultry, right? Salisbury steak. <sighs> it sounds delicious. Give me. Imagine if people mutated into monsters. I'm pretty sure I've seen some games where they do that. That happened to some of the monsters in Star Ocean 4. Some of the people, I should say, in Star Ocean 4 on one of the planets. I've definitely seen that plot before. People turn into monsters. Oh, wait, wait, wait. That was actually a plot in this series. In uh, Rebirth 3. There was a subplot with uh, human uh, children being turned into monsters. Why were they turning the monsters, though? Do I remember? Uh, give them energy... To, uh, power, power something. Or like the big bad guys or something. So, I forgot. It's Star Ocean games? Uh, not all of them. I played Star Ocean 3 way, way, way back on the PlayStation 2. And I played Star Ocean 4 way, way back on the Xbox 360. And I still have it like, uh, ha I, I completed 100% on 360, but I've only got it like half done on PS3, so... One of these days, we'll have to do the Star Ocean 4 on PS3 and get all the trophies. I do want to play the other games, though. Star Ocean 3 is available again on, like, PS4 now. I'll totally do it. I'll play 1 and 2. I've never played 1 or 2. I've never played, uh... Aren't there, like, two other ones now? There's, like, a 5 and a 6 now. I haven't played either of those. I'm way behind. I've only played like two of them. There's like six games now or something. Hey Pyra, what's up? Sap, how's it going? How you doing? No oh, wait, you were here earlier, weren't you? I think you were. You have many friends like Nep Pro? No, I don't have any pudding obsessed friends, I'm afraid. I have uh, I have a very uh, cat food obsessed cat. Does that count? That is enough. Oh. Awesome. Very well made assets. I mean, good quality textures and character models. Ooh, there's a really good one in Star Ocean 4. I forget what her name is. Muria or something like that? The elf lady? She's got some very nice assets. Ooh. I mean, uh, eye eyes. She has some nice hair and stuff.
I've always, I've always got one lady who's um, uh, well endowed, okay? Hey yo, yeah. Yeah, 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 pro. What, what, Pyra? What? What? We're having a wholesome conversation here. Family friendly. I never claimed to be family friendly anyway, did I? Just cause I don't have my stream marked as 18 plus doesn't mean I'm family friendly. I'll send you a greet every word. <laughs> good, 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 good. We have to watch all these cutscenes because uh, the first uh, requirement for the true ending involves watching cutscenes in the Zero Dimension chapter. But the guide doesn't specify which cutscenes. The guide just says, just watch all the cutscenes and you definitely won't miss it. And it's like, oh, okay. So we're, we're watching all the cutscenes in this section. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I got the hidden treasure here. So I do think it reset them all. I, choose you. I do think I have to get all the hidden treasures again. I don't have scouts yet either. Ooh. Maybe they'll pop up when I get the scouts. Haven't I been here already? Oh, I gotta go over there now, huh? Like now that I'm in New Game Plus, I got a flag to move faster. I can move faster and not have to fight people on the overworld. Bah! I should open those boxes when I see them, though. Because I have to do the trophy to get items from those boxes. I'm so fast now. But I want to check down here first. I don't think there are any items, but I want to double check. Because I didn't fully explore the map before. Yeah, there's nothing here. Not even any boxes. Can I break the benches? Dang it. Like Alright, let's go to the event. Probably play gotcha games to so put money on male characters. Ah, uh, I wouldn't spend any money on a gotcha game, period. I don't need my money. I wouldn't I would put actual real money toward, like, uh, anybody. If they give me, like, free uh, premium currency like some games do, sure. But I wouldn't, like, buy any of that premium currency and then buy, roll for characters or whatever. If I theoretically did, would I do it for male characters? Uh, it would entirely depend upon if the character was good or not or what, whatever. Like if they were OP or whatever. Oh, this is one of those. I think these are the cutscenes that the guide's talking about. Ones that feature like uh, history and stuff. I think these are the types of cutscenes the guide's talking about, but who knows? Oh, I saw all of them! What streamers see say they wouldn't only get them free, but throw the whale for the cute females. Oh, uh, what? Oh my gosh, I can't believe they're choosing fashion over function. It's supposed to be whichever one is strongest and is gonna kick butt, don't you know? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Gosh. Uh, what am I doing now? Oh, I'm going back this way. I choose you. More cutscenes. I would throw the wallet for the assets totally. Hmm. If I if I if I theoretically didn't care about giving money to these uh, multi-billion-dollar corporations or million-dollar corporations or whatever, and uh, didn't mind spending money on it, probably yes. 
I, I have a principle to not spend money on those types of games, though. I want to earn it. I'm like some weirdo. I'm probably a masochist. Have I played Stalker? I have not. What kind of game is that? Sounds like a stealth game. I think that is an older one. It sounds kind of familiar. Definitely never played it, though. Oh, well, next thing. Let's double check to make sure there's nothing over here. Okay, nothing here. Oh yeah, we haven't saved yet. In like two hour, hour or something. Let's make our first save. Ever heard of stalker games? It sounds slightly familiar, but... What's EX stand for? I don't know what that red EX stands for, but okay. should be around here somewhere <gasps> voices somewhere? not voices he was? hey umio give us a shout if you're here no go away didn't get cut short it'd be cool if we found someone who could point us in the right direction i'm not sure rescue missions are ever that convenient you never know a mysterious bystander might have been accompanying umio when he was attacked maybe they both escaped now it's time for her moe mode the introduction around looking for us we'll just happen to run into them we'll be totally surprised at the coincidence and like both uzume and her new pal totally won't be able to believe it you know then just like that they'll lead us to where umio is and we'll like beat up the meanie monsters that were bullying umio umio saved and we'll find the share crystal and we'll be totally super lucky like that <laughs> so, yeah, there's a small chance someone will appear to show us the way, right? Uh, Uzume, <laughs> sorry, but what in the world was that thing you just turned into? Uh, oh, I think you're just imagining things. No, 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 I most definitely was not. You just transformed into some kind of valley girl from the 90s or something. You were referring to yourself as Uzume in the third person, too. You're hearing things! Or maybe there are monsters that can create illusions around here! <laughs> Those crazy beasts! Yeah, 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 yeah. Suzume! The Suzume! S someone actually came? Sweet! Nice timing, baby bug! Huh? Nice... timing? Oh, uh, just something concerning us. More importantly, you This is the one they renamed Fried Shrimp later, I think. Yes! Because they think he looks tasty. The survival horror first person shooter, you think? Ugh. That sounds terrifying! Also, adventure, it's like Fallout, except it's in Chern Chernobyl and darker. Ooh! It's Fallout slash Metro or something. She seems like she's trying to hide it, but. Hey! What are you guys doing? I'm gonna leave you behind! I'll show you the way! Please hurry! Whoa! Wait up! Exactly! Ooh! Umio's in here? Yes! My friends and I were originally using this place as a house! We happened to find something that looked like a share crystal in the far back, so we asked Umio to check if it was real. But while that was happening, a monster we've never seen before suddenly appeared. I really hope Umio is okay. Okay. He's not. He's totally dead. So, was that share crystal Dark ending. Real? Yes, of course. Umio is holding on to it right now. So the monster won't destroy it. We'd better hurry and save him. Here you go. I'm destroy these now. Take that. Here you go. Here you go. Hmm. I don't know where I'm going. I'm not sure though. That's just a barrier. Not that. Here you go. Hello, treasure. I'm not sure why you want to die, but okay. 
Not sure why you guys want to duh. I'm like 5 billion levels higher than you. This is suicide. I don't think there were ever any down there. We ever saw any that way. Alright. Another time to become a fried shrimp, baby bug. You seen stream of Metro? It's a bunch of schizo with communism on it. Oh man! I've only played a little bit of Metro 2033 on 360. I'll have to get back to it and get all the achievements at some point. And then, then go do them properly on PS4 or something with, with uh, pretty graphics, right? I can't... Uh, a little bit I played is spooky, though, man. You'd go around a corner, there'd be, like, this mutated monster thing. and be like, Rah! You'd be like, ah, ah, ah. A Pokemon is that? Um, it's, um... It's, uh... I don't know Pokemon names. It's a Peekabug. It's a Peekabug. Yep, yeah, this one you get the name Fried Shrimp. Oh no. This guy's just fried shrimp the entire rest of the game, not even the cutscene. Future cutscenes like tens of hours from now. It's just referred to as fried shrimp. Uh uh. Uh uh. Uh -oh. It's a Weedle. Oh, it's a fried shrimp. What about Pokemon? Like, how many have I played? I've only played the very first gen. I, I played Pokemon Yellow bajillion years ago. When I was a wee little pro. I haven't played any of the other ones. What's this one? I break these. Break that. Break these guys. I can even break the metal ones here now. I'm all powerful. Hmm. So there's two ways to go. No, I don't remember which way is which. Here you go. Here you go. We do have to destroy those boxes and get items like we just did. Hey, even these metal ones don't stand a chance. I can break whatever I want now. Here you go. Here you go. And go wherever I please. Here you go. Here you go. Here you go. Here you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. What? What do you mean I can't? That, that's the dumbest shit I've ever seen. Uh, that's probably from the other entrance. Don't tell me I can't jump that baby barrier. I call bullshit, man. Ooh, an item. What's the pro thinks of Pokemon food. 
I mean, some of them got look pretty tasty, you gotta admit. Here you go. You gotta admit it. Some of them look pretty tasty. This is the other side of that barrier, right? Here you go. Here you go. Got an item. Here you go. Here you go. Oh, okay. I'm looped back around. Oh, it's time for another one of the history cutscenes. That I think are the required ones we're talking about. To be fair, if you saw a tasty looking Pokemon, you'd think of food too, right? There's probably a Pokemon that looks like a cheeseburger by now. They've got like, what, 800, 900 of them? There's gotta be one that looks like a cheeseburger. You'd be like, <laughs> Tasty! Isn't there one that looks like an ice cream cone, actually? I think there's an ice cream cone one. You got rubber seed of that. Being like, what the fuck? They run out of ideas? Ooh, an item. Can't sneak past it. There's like invisible line. In the previous Rebirth games, you could actually like kind of go around the event to like fully explore the dungeon. This game, this game, you got like a visible line. Can't go explore. Once you cross that line, you get your cutscene. Look at all this fried shrimp. The the doggos are uh, like Jello, right? Seen some Pokemon cooked, and they feed their Pokemans with Pokemon food too. <gasps> but what is the Pokemon food made out of, huh? You ever notice with Pokemon that uh, you've got clearly carnivorous monsters, but they don't they just eat fucking like Pokemon food? Nobody ever hunts anything in the wild, right? Bro, yawn. <sighs> See, you did. You made me yawn. How could you do it? How could you? You know you can't talk about that. Those are like contagious. Fried shrimp is here. Fried shrimp's pretty tasty. Hey, one of you fuckers. I've 
Probably would have still made me do that cutscene if I had one shot. That's right. That should be the last of them. I think you're right. Since there aren't any more. Wait a moment. Those fried shrimps are the ones Umio's evacuating. Top priority citizens. That's goddamn right. Anyway, he's always calling Uzume with that mega classy voice of his. <laughs> uh uh, it's time for them to find out that Umio's not a man. Yes, I'm alright. I apologize. I've caused you such unnecessary trouble. I'll cut it out, Umio. I'm just glad you're here. I have some friends that want to meet you. Chloe eats fish. Ah. He no, likes tuna fish, but that's like it. Here. I have someone I want to introduce you to. I've tried giving her other types of fish before, like salmon, and she's like, nope. She's really picky. This is Umio. What? A <gasps> man? With a seriously stoic face? The, the gap between his smooth voice and... Wild appearance is astounding. Thought he was gonna be a handsome man. Ah, so you are the people Uzume wished to introduce to me. First, allow me to thank you for coming here to rescue me. I am eternally grateful. Despite his fishy appearance, his voice is godly, and his lines are so refined and smooth. Isn't he adorable? Uh, adorable? Yeah, don't you think he could be like a super adorable leisurely mascot character? If he was made into a cell phone strap, Uzume totally thinks it would get popular. Neptune, do you think he's adorable? N no, not in the slightest. Uzume, you're doing it again. Oh! <clears throat> so, yeah, that's what's up. That being said, it is a first for me to see humans other than Uzume. I had come to believe they were all wiped out. A first? Wiped out? Hmm. It looks as if these two young ladies have yet to comprehend the gravity of our situation. Before it returns, let us move to a safer area. We can converse there. Before it returns? What does that mean? It would appear we were not quick enough in our exit. It must have caught wind of us and returned. <laughs> This guy is. It's the one we failed to finish off. Why is it here? How do we get him here? That so what happened to him? Ran away from us and ended up here in the city. Damn it! I'm so sorry, Umio. It was because of my negligence that this all happened. There is no time for that now. The opponent is wounded. Uzume, can you finish this? Of course. I'm gonna end our fated relationship here and now. Were they thinking Umio would look like a handsome man, of course. You can't have such a smooth, deep, refined voice and not be good looking, obviously. And then he's just a fish! Can you believe this? Just watch me, Umio. This time I'm gonna defeat that doggy. I'll be serious. Well, another fight where Uzume transforms and doesn't get to do jack shit. That's definitely true. I can finally duke it out without being bothered by that stupid mutt. Thank you so much, Miss Uzume. Rest in peace, doggo. I didn't know what we do when it appeared. How can we ever thank you all? Hey, it's no big deal. You guys found a share crystal for me after all. Uzume, here. This is what the baby bugs discovered. Thanks, everyone. Let us return for now. I'm sure you are all tired. Hmm. Hello, other Uzume. Kurama. Uh, can't we just hang out here? I'm the celebrate. Hmm. 
Yeah, why is this a roasted fish party? You're eating Umio's fellow fish. How could you? I'm not a fan of Star Wars. I've seen a lot of the movies. I wouldn't consider myself a big fan or anything, but it's like the original ones are cool. I've seen most of the movies, I think. I think the three oldest was, and then the other was, so like the main six. And then I've uh, seen Rogue One. I've seen the ones with the uh, whatever the lady's name is. That other trilogy. So I've seen most of the movies. The main movies. I haven't seen like anything that's not a main movie though. I haven't seen any TV shows or anything. My newest Star Wars Disney show seems to be causing a lot of repercussions. Oh, really? I don't think I'll bother to watch it. I heard it's not very good. I mean, if they if they want if they want people to like their stuff, all they gotta do is make it good. It seems to be the norm nowadays. Yeah, uh, like I said, if it was good, nobody would care about anything else. It's like all these video games they've been making, like Suicide Squad and stuff. Um, if it was good, nobody would care about the, uh, like, DEI woke stuff. But Suicide Squad was garbage, so... They did like the first movies, the rest just became merchandise franchise. Yeah, pretty much. It's pretty much just a merchandise, uh, machine now. Disney is kind of like, you know, it's kind. Uh, I don't. I don't remember when. Uh, what's what's the guy's name? Lucas sold it to Disney, but whenever he did that, that's pretty much the end. That's pretty much the official end of Star Wars, right there. Everything after that's uh, merchandise, milking it. Although I think Rogue One was Disney, and it was pretty good. Maybe because it didn't have a happy-go-lucky ending, it had a more realistic ending. That was a good movie. I saw the ones with, uh, what was her name, though? I'm thinking of Ray. What's her name? I've seen them, but I didn't think they were that good. They were okay, but... not Definitely not as good as the first six movies. There's an Ahsoka Ta Tano series. Don't know much about, but can't say I've I've heard of that either. I haven't seen that. Uh, what's it called? Mandalorian or something? I haven't seen that either. I've heard that one's okay though. I think that's on like Netflix or something. I do not have the Netflix. I don't watch many shows. I mostly just play video games. I don't do much in my off time aside from play cool video games. Like this one right here. Cause I live under a rock if it's not a video game, right? 
and sometimes even if it is a video game. That's how it be, right? That's how it be. I have no idea what these people are talking about. I'm not paying attention anymore. I'm waiting for the next part where I move. My character to go do something. I'll be more interested when I get to the hyperdimension saga because then I will be able to skip cutscenes without worrying about skipping a cutscene that I need for the true ending. It'll be extremely easy to trigger the cutscenes I need and I know exactly when they'll pop up. Book of who? Booba Fett? Not Boba Fett? Booba Fett? That, that's probably uh, some alternative fan fiction version, yeah. <laughs> Indoor and Obi Wan Kenobi. I did hear Indoor is very good. Ah, okay. I do wonder if for Philly to play all the FIFA soccer games to get each year's trophies. Uh, I've avoided s sports games specifically for that reason. As they shut down the servers after like a year. And you can't get them. I don't know if I'll ever do sports games. It's kind of scummy to like, you know, have a game and re-release it every year and then shut down the uh, online for the previous one to force you to get the new one if you like that series. Like, if you like soccer, hey, you can't play with anybody. It's been like a year or two. Go go get the new one. If you want to play with your buddies again, go get the new one. I haven't actually played a sports game in, like, forever. I think I played, like, a soccer game way, 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 way back in, like, uh, Super NES age or something. I vaguely recall. I think that's, like, my last sports game. I haven't played any sports games uh, since doing achievement or trophy hunting for sure. It's like, those are like big red flags. So stay the heck away. Although they seem to be slightly better in letting you know that the servers are going to shut down nowadays. They give you a heads up now. Although it feels like every time I see it, a, a notice about a game, sports game getting shut down, they'll be like, Oh, by the way, like three of the achievements are already discontinued because they shut down the service for it or whatever. It's like, uh... Yeah. They've given out several sports games, though, with uh, PS Plus. Or PS Plus Essential, I guess it's called now. And most of them have probably already shut down. Dog, what? Does we know what type of book it is then? Hee 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 hee. F113 is a sports game, you guess. It's a racing game! How dare you call a racing game a sports game? You can't complete that one now either. If you started it today, you wouldn't be able to complete it. Because there's an achievement or trophy or whatever you want to call it, depending on your platform, to uh, make a race net account, and uh, that's what they shut down. Back in February, so you can't get the car required to get the achievement slash trophy because you can't make a race net account. I think that's EA's fault, though, right? Didn't they buy they buy Code Masters or something? Then EA ruins everything by shutting things down and stuff. Holy shit! We got to the end of the cutscene. I have no idea what they're talking about, though. I stopped paying attention. I guess the racing games could technically be sports games. They seem to last longer before they get their servers shut down, though. Didn't they shut down, like, Crew earlier this year? And, uh, Gran Turismo Sport or something? I had Gran Turismo Sport in my backlog, but then I saw it t takes about 200 hours. And they, uh, the sh server shutdown was only like two months notice and wasn't going to give you enough time to really do it. So I was like, nope, remove from backlog, not doing it. Crew sucks anyway. Oh man, but I got it for like free some year or something. I never got to play it. 
So... Grand Turismo 7's open run just fine. It's not like the newest one though. Didn't they just announce Forza Horizon 4 is going bye bye? Why can't they just adjust their uh, trophies or achievements so that you don't need uh, online in order to get them, huh? That would solve the problem. Pudding! Give me my pudding! Forza sucks too. What? I've never tried a Forza, so I can't uh, argue with that. Forza is about getting an object or a thing on a specific spot in the arena. Could be a ball, car, or person. I guess so. I guess so. F1's mid as well. How dare you! How dare you! F1 was okay. It being my first sim racing game. It was okay. Everything except Monaco. And Singapore. Singapore was okay, I guess. Monaco can go, like, die. The Need for Speed be a sports game? Hmm, I don't think arcade-style uh, racing games would count. Uh-oh, Moe mode back. She's gonna imagine some pudding into existence. We're gonna go find some ingredients in the bed and grocery stores nearby. We're gonna go get them. Let's get our pudding, everybody. Gran Turismo is actually fun and recommended for trophy stuff, you do. Hmm, I don't know if I've played a Gran Turismo game. I've done uh, Need for Speed before. I played Need for Speed Most Wanted, uh, like 2018 or something. That was the last Need for Speed game I played, so it's been a while. I played Burnout before too. It's pretty cool. Did out? I did like Burnout Revenge, I think. Probably about the same. 2019, 2020, somewhere out there. I do like Pokemon. Gotta play them all. Ugh. You can't play them all if uh, the servers are shut down, though. Come on now. Unless you don't care about trophies or achievements, I guess. Although I feel like sports games, like especially things like soccer, basketball, whatever, are so similar year after year that yeah, I wouldn't really be missing anything by just skipping to the newer ones. Remind me to do Heat, Need for Speed. Heat is fun too. Ooh, I think I have several of them on the backlog. That's probably one of the ones I got. That's right. You're not gonna find any fish eggs from Umio. He's not. He's not got. He's not, you know, a, a lady fish. Try it. Oh my gosh. Uh, now I have to go look at the trophy god and see it's 500 hours. He's a fish, not a fish A fishette. Oh, wait. Inverse. <laughs> There she goes, zapping things into existence again. Has I got a glitch for you? Deep Speed Heat if you do play it. Uh, cheese? Cheese? Uh, cheese. Cheese! Cheese is tasty. 
I love some good cheese. Most of the time, anyway. I don't always cheese. I just cheese if I feel like the game's bullshitting me, and that's about it. Like, I did Vanquish legit, even though uh, there's a cheese there where you can, like, have infinite grenades or something. I didn't feel like I was bullshitting this. I was like, I'm gonna do it legit. Boom, we did it. But those, uh, those, um... NPC enemies in Bloodborne, I will cheese the shit out of those fuckers any day. Those guys are ridiculous. Let's just say it allowed me to get 260 million dollaritos. Whoa! That sounds like a lot of money! Well, let's ask Umio something. Oh god, I'm. Oh no, it's this cutscene. Oh no! The nightmare fuel. Well, damn, it's like 3 a.m. I gotta go to sleep soon. Where should we? <gasps> oh, we don't need to see Ubia with legs. Oh, wow. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. horrible nightmare. Let's never picture it again. What about honor, pro? The monsters in Bloodborne have no honor. Therefore, neither shall I. Ludwig had some kind of honor. Look that guy. He was probably the toughest uh, boss of the game for me. Although, I made the mistake of going and doing the DLC on New Game Plus. Because I, you know. I didn't want to start a new playthrough. It'll be a new game. New character. Probably made me struggle more. And I've got that going on Elden Ring too. I'm on New Game Plus on that too. I'll probably regret it. I'll be like, ah, blah, blah, blah. music was dope as always. Oh yeah, music's awesome. I think my favorite uh, DLC fight was Maria though. I think that was her name. It was cool. Tea party. It's a pudding party, not a tea party. Get it right. Ooh. I'm waiting for it to finish the cutscenes and get my next uh, destination, and then it's sleep time. Melania. Oh, she's pretty cool. Took like 16 hours to beat her my first playthrough, though. She was tough. But I won in the end. 
She's definitely tougher. I feel like she'd be easier with like a ma magic build. I just, I'm just pure melee. I just use my katana. Being a total wee, bruh. Or I slaughtered everything. I don't know why, but personally for me, waving a stick isn't as much fun. Although the magic does look pretty cool in Elden Ring. But I prefer to get in there and go slicing and dicing. Rather than hide back and be like, okay, I'm gonna wave the stick. Okay, I'm gonna wave the stick. No personal preference. Oh, looks like I got my next destination. Well, you know what that means? That means it's sleepy time. I'm tired. What's that? There's nothing else there. Alright. The Making some progress. Slowly but surely. <laughs> That's it for today. We got our characters leveled up. We got all the first playthrough stuff done. All we gotta do is the stuff for true ending. And then uh, boxes and items and all the hidden treasures and that's about it. We'll probably finish this in like two, maybe three more streams. If I could skip all the cutscenes in zero, I could say I would say two, but since I can't, I'm not sure. Definitely not one more stream, though. We got two more at least. <sighs> Your brain's going to implode. Mine's going to, um, um, explode into sleep. I didn't think I could see enough of the pink haired lady from this game that says jump like a bunny. I'm on red trip. This Japanese guy's picture for us is PFP. Napgear is best lady, that's why. Napgear best girl. Best grill. Best woman. Although I like Big Nap as well. Nepgear's been in the game since, like, uh, pretty much Rebirth 2. He showed up in, like, a special hidden cutscene at the end of Rebirth 1, but that doesn't really count. Nepgear been the best lady since Rebirth 2. Even if she has been the, the butt of many jokes. Fourth wall jokes. You get some good time to shine in this game. It was about enough for the day, though. It's enough video games. It's time for sleepies. <sighs> I like how Usume's got two, 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 two SP, and then one, 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 and then it gets ruined. Not one, 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 one. So close. A little bit too, too high HP, though. Good morning. I guess it's technically AM, but it's good night to me. Even though it's AM. That was another hip and hop and bop and pop and stream. It was very cool. It was very profile. It was very awesome, okay? Thanks for pro stream, little gun. Thank you for hanging out, cat. Thanks for hanging out, Pyro and Woo Up and Mexican Boy and um, uh, um, uh, uh, everybody else who stopped by tonight who I forgot. Much appreciated. Been a cool time. Head back. We got many things done. We're working our way towards the final stretch. Have a sweet, very late night sleep. I will. I will. I will. Whoosh. Uh -uh, I should be back tomorrow. With some more. Uh, what are we doing? Far Cry Three, I believe. That'll be cool. Go back to exploring that map and um, uh, uh, running into more um, uh, people who aren't very friendly. 
Until then, though.